But we are moving on to a new game, which I will have to change up on the category for the stream today. It is a quieter game. It doesn't seem like it has very many followers on Twitch, which is fine. But also, my OBS is not liking me switching up things. Thank you, OBS, for the switch up. Uh, here we are. Siege of Dungeon Chat. This is a game that was gifted to me, and it's a game that I've been interested in. Definitely interested in. Now, that should be working, right? OBS, you good? Yes? No? Yes? No? OBS! OBS! The music is pretty good. It is- it's not crashing. It's just OBS is not picking it up. And it was picking it up when I tested this the other day. Capture a specific window. Okay. Yeah, you're seeing something Snow's face. Yeah, yeah. Snow's face is here. Oh, hi, Mao. He came back. Oh. Yeah, Mao indeed. I know what I did wrong. I'm an idiot. Was there a spin that I missed? I missed a spin? I didn't hide oh, Battle Brothers. God, it's a necro. Women and men, soldiers and outlaws, fools and corpses. Fools and All corpses. will find their way to us now that the road is clear. Why is it still not working? That's weird. Do you want to take spins off? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I do want to take spins off, Lolly. I'll have to refund that one to you because we're... It's always the tricky thing to do when I'm switching games. Uh, let's turn off the BB Bros. Let's turn off the spins. We'll sort that out. Yes, yes, that's good. No, I can't give you your spin as much as you really want it. <laughs> Not currently on the Battle of Bros. Oh, it's working! It just took a second. Sheesh. No, I have something of great importance that I, Snowbot, must now let you know. Snowbot, now's not the time. I'm too busy running everything. Snowbot, what I, you got? the indomitable snowman, hereby endorse Milo plus egg as a legit healthy breakfast. Don't listen to him, chat. He's an imposter. He is a complete imposter. Don't listen to him. Complete fake imposter. There's no way Snow would ever, ever endorse that. Not in the slightest, Stefan. Okay, let's just complete all these requests so it's not a problem. <laughs> Hmm. Is Zoro being mean? Slap him. Zoro is not meant to be eating her food. He knows he's not meant to be. He's trying to get away with it. He's a cheeky one. Lolly, yes. Yes, I did. <laughs> I have the power as the streamer. I have all the power. I can refund. I can play God. <laughs> okay. It's an outrage, exactly. Have I had other breaks than my lunch? Nope, just my lunch. So I had breakfast before I started the stream, and then I had lunch at about one o'clock-ish. And then we've just been going strong. Isn't that right, Meow Meow? Yes, we've been going, well, mostly strong. Okay. Welcome to Siege of Dungeon Chat. Siege of Dungeon is a RPG dungeon crawler kind of game that is, I think, according to my memory, turn-based. 
It's pixel graphics and it gives you a party situation, kind of like Darkest Dungeon. But you'll get to see how we go as it is. It's great. Give me my spin, says Lolly getting bullied. No, I know what you're talking about. No idea what you're talking about. Okay. So, you get to pick your party. You have to start with three bros and you get to choose who they are. So, we've got Samurai, Archer, Unlocked After Clearance. That looks like a barbarian berserker thing. Magic Weapon and a priest person. So, who do you guys want in the party? I mean, there's three women and one guy, so... Unless that's a woman, too. I can't tell. Lots of options. Hide the bingo. Oh, yeah, the bingo shouldn't be on. There we go. There we go. Also, I'm hiding the samurai. There we go. That's what the samurai looks like. There's the archer. So the samurai, archer, mage. I can always put my face back as well. There we go. Very cool. Pirates are greater than ninjas. Well, it's always the pirates versus ninjas fight. It always is. All right, samurai is built around melee and a little bit of defense, not super fast. The archer is very fast, decent attack, not as much defense, but has whatever this skill is. I don't even know what that skill is. Attacks, defenses, it kind of sucks that I can't see what skills they use. But I'm thinking the priest is always a good call, unless you want to go full DPS. So how about we go... Wait, can I not... Oh, okay, I can do it like this. How about we go Samurai Archer Priest? Take the waifu, yeah. I'm assuming the archer is the main waifu here. We go full physical damage and go priest. This might be a good combo. Okay. Merchant. Hey there. Challenger clues of clues of true desperation. Pardon my impoliteness. Thanks for coming all this way. You must have a good reason for coming all this way. Your soul. I smell great potential dwelling within your soul. I offer you my assistance in the desert. I can offer you greater power in exchange for soul coins that your journey has been collecting. How far can you reach within the limited time? It's called limited time. Oh no, don't tell me it's a speed run. Starting bonus. All characters gain three maximum MP, five relic fragments, or one relic refresh. I don't know what these do. Um, I think five relic fragments is not a bad start. Settlement of goblins to begin, and we're trying to go down into the dungeon. So it's kind of like a Slay the Spire kind of thing as well. Yes. I got an achievement for entering the dungeon for the first time. Thank you. Choose a relic. Okay. Samurai only. Whenever his armor falls, deal damage to a random enemy equal to 50% of the fallen armor. I think it's similar to Darkest. Not Darkest. Similar to which one? Maybe like across the obelisk where like the armor stays only within the round. Or maybe it's like the armor stays for a bit. We'll have to see. Aim shot applies to Hunter's Mark. Probably not a good choice. Removes all debuffs from your target. Ooh. If you're healing allies and removing debuffs, that could be really good. I might go with the priest one. Can I move chat up? Yeah, I could move chat up. That might make it easier. Uh, where would chat fit that makes it out of the way? Because there is the health thing up there. We'll see. I might move chat, but I might not. Because I have to put chat somewhere. We'll see. Any of the turns gain two armor. Ooh, that's nice. Two HP and MP when defending. Decrease MP. No, let's get two armor at the beginning of each turn. Movement points. Very nice. When everyone ends their turn, an hour will pass. Okay, so that's the time aspect. It's a very turn-based game. Uh, conquer the boss rooms on every floor. Can only stay on every floor for a certain number of hours. Everyone can move together or you can split the party. Very nice. Very nice. Okay, so is chat in the way? Not entirely. I can still see these things. I could maybe put like chat up here, but I want to see what the combat looks like first. Change the run description. Sh 
sure. Um, entering the dungeon. There we go, that'll work. And it's not current run meter. Yeah, I know, I know. Switching around games is tricky. Okay, oh, we can zoom out a lot. Okay, so we're kind of going north. That is, whoa, we can zoom in a lot. Altar of Strength seems nice. Uh, okay. Interesting. Interesting. How do I do the whole group of everybody moving? Search for the elite enemy room in the settlement of goblins. Interesting. Interesting. Skip turn collective action. Ah, collective action. Here we go. Okay, who has extra movement? Three, five. Okay, let's go to individual action. Because then I can put ladyface, archer into this room, check it, and then come back. Smart, smart. Can I rename my characters? Party. Can I not rename them to chat members? Oh, What kind of RPG doesn't let you rename your characters? That sucks. Okay. Let's move collectively. I know, completely scammed, chat. All characters caught in the battle and brought to the battle. Oh, there's a battle! Let's do it. It's a single goblin blowpiper. You gain 1 BP at the beginning of turns. Skill burst with reinforced skills cost 2 B without spending any AP. Remember to use BP frequently during battles. Okay, turn-based economy. We go first, the goblin goes second, and then third and fourth is nice. Hey, Yugian, welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. The crusade is upon us. Welcome, raiders. You've come along at a great time. You found us at a subathon. Snowathon. Same thing. Welcome, welcome. We're happy to have you. Also, I might move chat above the screen because it does get in the way. So, let's do, let's see if I can copy, paste, let's move chat up to the top there. I think I did that correctly. Yep, that looks good. Uh, pin both of those, and then I do chat box, copy and paste, and then we're good. Stream 46 hours, oh God, oh God. well, I, I will have sleep in between. Don't panic too much. There will be some sleep. It's not gonna be just 46 hours straight, but um, it's probably gonna be a decently long stream over the week or so, depending on how it goes. Depending on how long chat makes it go. But for the moment, we racked up a lot of a lot of hours early on. Uh, where's my subathon? There it is. There it is. Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one. And then I can minimize this one. Okay, that looks better, chat. That looks a lot better. But yeah, so we did a lot of Battle Brothers, and we only just got out of it recently, Bishido, because we just quickly um, switched over to this game. For the rest of the night, though, after we do a bit of Siege of Dungeon, we will jump back to some Battle Brothers. We've got a brand new mod that is based around uh, a snowman monster, which we got personally made for us, which is amazing. So we can't wait to start fighting some of the snowmen ourselves. It's a really cool monster, and we got a really cool boss involved as well with 
some really cool mechanics, a nice quest, all sorts of cool stuff like that. Uh, Wingate, thanks for the 13 gifted. Much appreciated, man. Thank you so much for the support. Thank you so much. Uh, and that's adding us up to over 48 hours. Oh, chat's never going to let me go. <laughs> Which is great. So, we will be fine, and we're going to have tons of fun with it. So how do we attack? We do a basic attack. Nice. Poisoned Blade, we have three stacks of poison. That's not really good. Six damage is nice. Can I tell who he wants to attack? I'm not sure. Can I skill and heal myself? Oh yeah, 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 I can. Heal yourself. And Holy Mark removes all the debuffs, which is what we just gave her. Which is very nice. Uh, he doesn't say who he's attacking, does he? Ooh, that's tricky. So it's a 33% chance he attacks at anybody, I think. I wonder if I get MP back at the end of the turn. I hope so. Yep, he's attacking randomly. Interesting. What's up, dear? What type of tape? Oh, you mean scotch tape. Yeah, I got scotch tape. Yeah, yeah, there you go. All oh, good. Never can run out of tape, chat. Maybe 25% chance of sex to, to squirrels? Well, hopefully. That would be nice. Okay, easy kill there. I'm worried about the poison staying after battle, but that's okay. Soul currency is the currency we need. Trade with the merchant, 29. Nice. Relic fragments. Upgrade class relics. Oh, that's what we got. Okay, so now we get a fancy reward as well. 20% extra souls. Mm, that's not much. Restore an extra 4 HP. 3 mana. So man is not restored after combat. Let's go with the souls. Just because I didn't use much of other resources that we currently had. Another raid and I'll give another hundred bucks to the subs that do not happen. I'll get tomorrow. Thank you, Wingate. I appreciate it. You're definitely bringing all, of, all stops out today for the lovely stream. Oh, I found the boss room. Alter strength versus boss room. So I should probably go for the Ultra Strength, right? Because I've got 10 hours in this entire room, which means 10 turns. It's not bad. Maybe there's a relic that tells us the attacking. There might be. That might be for sure. Hi, Mao. Is it cuddle time again? Oh, I just can never tell. You are my alarm clock for cuddle times. Okay, come on, Mao. Yeah. Hello. Hello. It is cuddle time. Yes, it is. She's a good meow meow. Yes. Thank you, Sing, for the tier one gifted to Yugi and much appreciated. Uh, what does this lovely thing do? Confirm to use the altar to do what? Offer HP to upgrade the altar? No. I probably just want to confirm to use the altar. Priest gets a permanent attack. Okay. Not bad. Okay, it's boss time. I don't know why I have 10 hours to stay here. Do I just keep farming before I go for the boss fight? Oh god, maybe I had to. This looks tough. Oh lord, that's a lot of health they're attacking for. Physical damage to all enemy targets. 9 to a single with a crit. I need to go for a single target. 12 crit, let's go. Three plus 100 armor to a consumal armor. Deal two times four to a single target. Gain 50% of lost armor afterwards. 10 physical damage to a target. Uh, I think I need the armor. Because then I'm back up to five armor. That's really nice. Three damage across the board. We get blocks on some of those because the armor we have. Okay, I need to heal. There we go. Nice heal. Nice heal. This dude's almost dead. 
Okay, that's the boss, I think. Goblin Mutant versus Goblin Mages. Five damage, Mage is dead. Uh, let's go for another Fury Slant. No? Sudden Slash. Yeah, let's go for a Sudden Slash. Or do I go for a Guard? Reduce damage and get four armor. Let's try that. Yeah, that was good. That blocked the attack. That doesn't get killed targets quicker, but that's okay. My best target for the attack boost, but boost still boosts. Yeah, that's true. It is true. Uh, I could go for another Blessing or Holy Light. My Holy Mark to yourself. No, I don't want to do that. I think I just guard on the Priest as well, just so she doesn't get hit. Okay, that goes through my armor. Archer seems to be the right play here. I just worry about running out of mana. Sun Slash goes to Mail Order Slash. Yeah, yeah, the Snail Slash. Sun Slash versus Snail Slash. I agree. Uh, Cedric, enjoy the lurk, my man. Uh, what else are we going for? Sun Slash now? Yes. Because that means I can use the Priest to kill him. Okay, we block all the damage. That's good. Uh, I need to heal, but I also really need to kill this dude. Okay, now it's 3v1, we can win this. Oh, you can enhance your skills! How do you do that? Yeah, let's just guard here. Oh, you choose the burst option. I see. Oh, and I gave an evasion stack? Ooh. That didn't work because he attacked me instead. Guaranteed to crit on a 12. You know what? I'll do it. 16, let's go. Uh, and then we can attack normally, which is fine. Six damage and he's dead. Nice! Also, chat, thank you for the amazing hype train. Once again. Overjoyed for all of that. You guys are doing so many wonderful things, including keeping it at 48 hours. And we got a lot to do for this lovely stream, so yeah. Time to my 16 hours nap. See you lads soon. No worries, you have a good one, man, and we'll catch you when we come back. Uh, Soul 71, let's go. Relic Fragments 8. Holy Healing. Holy Healing Skill. Ooh. Reveals the location of boss enemies. 3 mana or 20 souls. 20% souls is pretty good. But. That's not 20%. Oh, 14. 20% of 14. That's not very much. I'm going with Magical Water. I used a lot of mana in this fight, so let's go with mana. New Relic. Deal 4 damage to enemies below 50% HP. That's good for quickening kills. Uh, Steel Plate is reduced damage taken by 3 when HP is below... No, that's only... Mm, that's only if you're really struggling. Each stack of burn deals two extra damage. I don't have any. I don't have the mage, so I'm gonna go torture's whip. That's extra damage against people who are low health. That's really nice. Oh, and we healed up after the boss fight too. Nice. Max HP plus seven. Nice. Now I don't know if I was meant to grind the previous floor. I sense treasure nearby. I also see a battle nearby. MP increased. Very nice. Okay, bring it on. Difficulty 2 fight. Understandable, understandable. This dude's fast, the mutant. Okay, poisoned is not good.
Okay, there. Status refresher. Get rid of the poison. BP2. Okay, now... Good block, good block. Can I... Deadly Precision this dude for 16? Mm. I can attack him for 9. Dang it! I can't kill him unless I use the Deadly Precision. 21. Oh, Torturer's Whip! I forgot about the Torturer's Whip! Oh, I could have maybe saved some stuff there. That's fine. That's fine. Let's guard. And let's guard. Many of turns each gain two armor, which is great. Blocked the hits. Okay, okay, if I play defensively, chat, this isn't too bad. Does armor go away at the end of next turn? No, I think your armor stays. Oh, yeah. Can you just inf- wait, why did my armor go down? Does it not infinitely stay? It doesn't. Well, at least we're learning something new, chat. I think I guard on the May, the priest. She, he might be going for the priest this time. Nope, he went for Ladyface. But we win here. Yes, the Thorn Whip is amazing! Oh, it was such a good pick. 52 Soul Currency, 3 Fragments. I need to find a Merchant. Uh, 10 extra souls, not worth it. Healing is probably worth it. Yeah. Nice. Relic upgrade. When you have enough shards, upgrade it. Increase the damage dealt by 5%. Healing is increased by 1 point up to 6 stacks. Okay. It's not bad. Oh, I see a merchant over there. I see an enemy over here. And there's a long corridor down here, which is probably where the enemies are meant to be. So, let's... Oh, whoa, whoa, the scroll wheel is pretty bad on this. Let's do this. Confirm to trade. Merchant will vanish once traded with. Okay, sure. Sure thing. What you got for me, man? Don't ask where I got them. Uh, embed skills and learn skills. I don't know what that does. Significant target for 170% HP. Ooh. It's not bad, not bad. I already have Holy Light, which is deal 100% penetration damage. Heal target for 130% HP for 3 magic. 5 MP for a bigger heal. Uh, do I give it to someone else, though? No, I think the priest should keep this. Nice. Okay, uh, and then what else do we want to buy? Star fragments are expensive. Gain 1p at this sort of battle. That's really nice. I have 157 currency and 6 fragments. I am dirt poor. There's nothing here I can buy. One extra normal attack count. That's nice. 35% extra armor when defending. That's really nice. Increased healing and armor grants effects increased by 35%. All of these are nice. I just can't buy them. Can I sell something? No. I've got nothing to sell. Okay, buy merchant. I'm sorry. Oh, and buy meow meow. Sad snowman. What's in the chest? You're kidding me. 
You're kidding me. Well, I'm no longer broke. <laughs> the merchant's gone. I should have gone to the chest. I didn't even know there was a chest there. I couldn't see it on the map. Oh, okay. Uh, that would have been good to have before I went to the merchants. Cookies, exactly, exactly. Send me some more soul fragments. Oh, yeah. What's in the box energy? Exactly. What's in the box? In the box. What's in the box today? Incendiary shot. When enemy dies while afflicted by burn. No, I don't have burn. Uh, enemy prioritize attacking targets with higher armor. Okay, that could be really good. Restore 3 MP when you kill an enemy. That's also really good. Um... Dang it. I think I go Warden's Ward. Though, unfortunately, that doesn't give me more armor. It just gives them incentivized to attack the right targets. No, no, I think Warden's Ward's good. I like the star tier one, but I'm kind of managing man at the moment. Yep, that works. There's a campfire, which does extra healing. I don't need that. Okay, what is this? Is this a shade dude? What? 75 health? Thank goodness he's alone. Okay, I'm gonna guard here because then he's gonna attack me most likely. This dude is scary. Please attack my main character. He attacked as an AoE. That didn't do very much damage. Good. I don't want to waste my mana on this fight, but I'm kind of worried. Guard is good. Is he going to go AoE again? Oh, this dude does no damage. Wait. Chat, this dude does no damage. As long as I keep guarding. Okay, Mal, okay. This dude does no damage. It's perfect. Thanks, Mr. Ar Archer. What does he do? Each instance of dealing damage applies one power. Is he buffing himself? I can't see him buffing himself. Morning, Solem. Good to see you, man. Also, the Torture's Whip's gonna help us win this fight. Yeah, no, he's he's not doing enough damage to hurt us. Easy. He can't buff himself since he's not doing damage. Ah, that's the fun part, because he can't get through the shields. This counters him completely? This dark armor is overpowered. Nice. So easy. Yeah, it seems like it, Kel'Jen. It seems like it. Uh, do I need to heal? No, not really. Do I need mana? Not really. Do I need currency? I don't have a merchant. Uh, I guess the only thing that's going to be the most benefit is the healing. Yeah, fair enough. Probably lethal if you don't have damage. Yeah, if you don't have armor, this fight's probably very bad. Goblin dude, bring it on. Preemptive strike. Oh, he goes first? But I saw him a mile away. Jerk. If I guard here, there's a good chance he attacks me instead. Attack me in the front. Yes! Okay, God, I'm really glad I bought Warden's Ward. It's going to save us in all these basic fights. Because the tank is just too good. Please attack the tank. Oh, what's that? Eh, 
There we go. That was my alarm to go and remind myself that I'm streaming. I, I'm already streaming. <laughs> my alarm is not useful. The stream continues. Easy fight. And... A maximum hit point for all party members in the next hour. Okay, that's not... It's not great because my hour is almost over. Uh, let's go with the mana. I'm doing too well at the moment. I wonder if there's a difficulty modifier. And then we skip turn. And then we skip the turn. There we go. One hour's passed. Better defeat the boss before it's too late. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know the boss needs to be defeated before it's too late. And the boss is down here somewhere. There he is. Confirm to start the boss battle. Let's go. It's the same fight? This really feels like the same fight. Also, three times one is pretty bad. Oh, three times one is in three damage to each target, so that's nine damage, but it's split across. Okay. Uh, charge shot is better. Nice, good hit, good hit. Uh, let's guard up. Nice. Okay, you hit my other person, that's fine. Holy Healing is pretty good, but let's go with Holy Light. No. Attack him normally. Because that guarantees a kill for next turn. His Archer's fast. We take a hit, that's fine. Archer hits for nine. Yes! Good start, good start. We guard, that means we take the next Mage hit. No Mage with AoE. Okay, if you say so, buddy. Take one damage, that's fine. We're, we're guarding pretty well, chat. I think that's the main thing. Deadly Precision gets us 12 damage here. Guarantees a kill. We guard, and then we kill him. Oh, I probably should have just killed him. Ah, it's fine, it's fine. We're doing okay. Mm-hmm. Skill with Deadly Precision to get it cost no mana, because these BPs are amazing. Uh, we guard to make sure we get attacked. Get him below 50% health, so the Torturer's Whip procs. Wait, why did you attack her when he had more armor? Oh, that's annoying. I should probably kill him, yeah. I was thinking of healing during the fight, but I was like, no, I might as well do the end game, end of the fight thing. <gasps> Re-revive skill? Hello? 35% HP to all people. Yeah, let's do the healing potion. Oh, that's, an, that's a consumable. Yeah, yeah, I'll take that for later. Each crit heals you for 2 HP. Uh, the only person who gets a guaranteed crit is the Ranger. Uh, deal two damage to a random enemy every time your armor ga characters gain armor. That's broken! We gain armor every turn from the other thing that we do. Yeah, Iron Sand, 100%. The other one wasn't as good. Easy chat, we're, we're burning through this. Getting very good combinations. Uh, can I upgrade my shard? I can. All members, all attacks get plus one. Very nice. Everyone gets plus two defense. Everyone gets melee magic attack up one. And we upgrade our scripture. So now we have extra attack, extra healing. The priest is going to carry us. Okay, there is another ranger dude who seems to not do very well against us. And the rooms are getting bigger, but I still only have seven hours to win the game. Wait, that carries over? 
Oh, I see the problem. Also, there's a question mark event. Okay, let's go and introduce you here. I gotta be more careful with my time. Is STS Ironclad with Juggernaut? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Also, every time we gain armor, we just do damage to this dude, so that is fun. Look at this. Every time we gain armor, it's just two damage. Oh, it's too good. It's just free damage. Six damage per turn. This dude doesn't stand a chance. Free snipe, he's below 50% health. And he's on two health, that means he dies next turn. Too easy. I like this combo. We're playing very defensive chat, because I don't know how this game works. So it's very good to play defensive early on. Extra AP for movement, extra healing, extra mana. Let's go for movement. 100%. What I'm going to do a sleep, just stream you're sleeping. No, no, no. I'm going to do um, VODs in the background. And I'm not going to do sleep streaming. No, not this time. Maybe next time if we do another subathon somewhere down the track. But I don't have the bed set up in this room, and it's it's going to be a pain in the ass to get it all sorted. So, and I can't sleep on the floor. It's very painful. I've, I've done it before, but I don't like doing it. And if I'm going to keep streaming multiple days, it's not worth setting up a setup that's not comfortable. Because then I won't survive. But, uh, I will put up VODs up so you guys can watch that whilst I'm not live. You guys can keep lurking for extra snowballs. So that's why I'll keep the stream going. And I'll add extra eight hours onto the timer um, every time I need to go to sleep. So I did eight hours to start the stream today. So for tomorrow when I wake up, I'll add an extra eight hours to accommodate for my rough sleeping of eight hours-ish to add to the subathon. So it's not like you guys are paying to watch me sleep. That's the whole point. So it's not because you're, you're not going to watch me sleep. Therefore, there's no paying to watch me sleep. So there's that part of it. What if I sleep for more than eight hours? Then that's... Mm, then I'll refund you more than that. If I sleep for less, then I might still just give up the eight hours. I'll try and sleep an appropriate amount so I don't die throughout this entire subathon. And I'll also try and make sure it's fair. It makes sense. And yeah, all that kind of good stuff. Refund each viewer waiting. <laughs> no, Nightcrix. I love how you're trying to compound interest all of this. No, 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 no. <laughs> <laughs> Snow sleeping for more than eight hours. Hey, I like sleeping for more than eight hours. Thank you very much. How we don't do refund and you just set up a VOD for cat sleeping? Only problem with that hmm, is my cats don't really like staying. I guess Asha now sits under here. Yeah, I could maybe do that instead of the VOD. Cookie, that's not a bad idea. I could try and set up a, uh, the cat sleeping spot. I might see how I go with that. It might be tricky. Rather have me in good shape? Yeah, exactly. I've got lots of content to go through. So we do want to make sure the snowman does survive. Random event. Hello? Greed, you found a treasure room filled with dazzling treasures. Just as you're about to dive into them, a sharp voice rang in your ears. Halt. I'm the rightful owner of the treasures. Since you came all this way, I'll allow you to pick one thing amongst my possessions. Remember, only one. Maybe the blade. Because I'm thinking coins, the merchants haven't been good to me. There is a merchant just down south. Oh, Hodge. Okay. I was thinking the chest because our last chest gave us a ton of crap. That was really good. I don't know what the blade is, but the coin, we have a relic. What do you think, chat? You're back to watching the vault. Want to see the snowman? Oh, we haven't. We only saw the snowman at the very beginning. Well, once we had everything sorted, but we haven't fought them yet. We'll fight them tonight. Because they have to be spawning in after day 25 and after Renown 500. Chest could be a mimic. Ooh, yeah, it could all be a trap. And the coins could be like a coin enemy. 
because this is greed chat. Remember, this is greed. Or what happens if I choose more than one? That could be a problem. So I might go chest. 30% souls after battle. That's pretty good. I like that chat. That's pretty nice. Uh, let's move as a party south. Oh, was there an enemy above me? I think there was. Okay, merchant, I have money this time. Let me buy stuff, please. Thick custard, enjoy the lurk, man. Uh, I now have revive. It's ten mana. Let's give it to the tank. Six hundred and twenty-one points. I can't get blood surge. Life steal enhanced. I don't have any life steal. Reduce damage taken by one when you have no armor. That's pretty good. If I get stacked out. Skill gem, what do we have? This one's on sale. Deal 130% physical damage to a single target. Additionally, it occurs two follow-up attacks dealing three magical damage. Interesting. Focus, restore two BP for four mana. Spend four mana to get a free mana attack. That's interesting. Holy healing, I already have it. Burst magic, deal 80% magical damage to all enemies. Okay, the mage might be really good. Grants maximum plus three MP when embedded. Grants one defense when embedded. I think I buy more relics. Oh, but they cost 25 pieces, don't they? And I only have three pieces. These are so good, though. Oh, that's so good! If you heal somebody above their maximum HP, it gives them armor and guard. Negates one debuff. Oh, that's so nice. But I don't have shards because I can't I can't buy this without shards. I've been spending my shards to upgrade the relic I already do have. Wish I could convert money into shards because these are nice. I can convert money into refreshing these. That pursuing shot's pretty good, though. Hmm. Imagine being broke. Broke on one end, but I'm rich on the other end, which is sad. Okay, I could embed something else. What do I have? I've only got one more slot to embed. It's on Archer Lady. And she's currently doing 180 on a physical single target with a high probability of crit. Three times. I don't like the Reign of Arrows. Unless there's like tons of enemies on a battlefield, I don't feel like it's a good. Really don't think it's good. I think I buy the Martyr's Blood, to be honest, chat. It's a relic, so it sits on the bottom of my screen. And then I think I buy Pursuing Shot, just in case it does more damage. And put that on Archer Lady. I don't think that does more than charge shot, but maybe it does with the two extra attacks on an enemy that is below 50% maximum health. Because then it might trigger Thorn Whip multiple times. Because Thorn Whip gives you extra bonus damage to every attack you do below 50% health. So if it's four damage on each in individual attack, then follow up attacks could be really good for sealing the kill. Let's hope that works. Let's hope that works the way I'm thinking it does. 
Okay, I'm almost out of movement. Wait, why is she out of movement? It says two next to her. Oh, hi, Mao. Mao. Okay, up we come. Hello. Yeah. You wanting some pets? Yes, you are. Yeah. Good Mao. Okay, and then we move as a group and we go to the right. And then I think that's the best movement I have, other than separating the party. There we are. We're out of time. Better beat the boss before it's too late. We're down to six hours, chat. That's not too bad. We just have to find the boss. If it's in the top, then I'm going to be really sad. I hope it's in this bottom right corner. Priesty girl, move as a group. As a group. Double goblin action, eh? Not bad, not bad. Guard also does damage. I love it. Oh, the priest can do damage. It's so good. Oh, these goblins don't even stand a chance, chat. Look at this. Look at this. We're so defensive. I love our setup at the moment. Uh, extra souls, extra healing, extra mana. Let's go extra souls because I don't have any health or mana issues. As a group. Found the boss. Let's just skip to the boss. Let's save time. I don't need to do anything else in this area. Easy. Uh, blood for blood, double action. Double action boss? Okay, and he heals every time he does damage? I might need to spend some mana here. Let's go burst damage down here. Which then guard. I can guarantee the kill on the small one. That gives him strength? I don't like that. He's going twice. Ouch. Ouch. And he heals. Son of a biscuit. Deadly precision. Let's guard. Okay, that gives him strength again. Okay. Okay, uh, the fact that he attacks twice is really annoying because he's attacking my side characters, but I think we can win here. How much does this do? 10 plus 3 plus 3 is 16, plus the 2 from here. We guard up, which is really nice. Do we heal now? I kind of don't, don't want to be caught with my pants down. But 14 health doesn't seem like... I'm only missing 12 health. Actually, 14 is really good there. Okay, now he's going to hit a side character. He hits the front character, that's good. Question is, do the three follows benefit from the bonus at low HP? That's the thing I really want to find out. But I can't tell at this point in time. Because if they do, it's more damage than this attack. Except this attack's guaranteed to crit. So that's like a 19. And that's without the bonus bottom damage, so... Maybe it's just not worth it. But that was a nice, easy fight once we got rid of the minions. And got that guaranteed crit. Uh, extra souls to get an extra... 20% on this 48. Teleport party members to the current room. Healing? I think the teleport stone could speed up the fight. Um, just speed up an area. New relic. Oh, some rare ones, I think. Maybe the purple is rare. 
exotic yet vicious snake with two heads. Poison and burn triggers two times per turn. I don't have poison and burn. Each crit applies one power to all your characters, maximum two stacks. That's good because I do crits with Ranger Lady. Emergency Steel Plate is still nice. But I'm already doing so well. I think I go crit. And we heal after a boss fight, so I don't need to heal. Seems good to me. Okay, we're on the next floor. How far down are we? We're on four out of four of goblins. Six hours to go. Okay. I'm assuming the boss will be in one of the corners here. So we could go to the merchant, but I don't think he's going to have anything I want. What is that? That is big. Okay. Okay, let's get this started. Preemptive strike is annoying because that means I take damage for free. But other than that, I should be able to win without taking any more damage. Because he attacks my main character. Yeah, I, I really think Warden's Ward was a really good pickup. Ah, he dies to the mist. Soul currency, good. Relic, good. Uh, defensive used to gain an extra hour in the dungeon. You know what? Sure. I don't need that much currency. An hour could make a big difference. Gate of challengers appeared. Search for the location of the boss. This might be a challenger. Don't go to the merchant. Oh, he could give me a relic. How's the PP run going? It's going great. We're definitely doing the PP run right now. Decrease MP cost by three in the first turn. That is good. I'll do it. That's free magic on the first turn. Thank you, merchant. That's a good merchant. Goodbye, buddy. Oh, this is going to be a tough fight. It's a difficulty three fight. Gonna be the hardest fight we've done so far. Oh, they're huge. Colossal riders. And I got poisoned. But hey, it's minus three mana every single time on the first turn, so let's go charge shot and kill this dude. Almost kill this dude. Okay, now we need to go Holy Light on this dude, because that'll get rid of my poison. No, it doesn't. I thought that was going to get rid of my poison. Where's the snowman with the hat? I know, where is the snowman with the hat? What snowman? Snowman with a hat? Exactly. Uh, da -ba -da -ba -da, mana, mana, mana. Deadly precision? These guys are using armor! I knew this fight wasn't just going to be simple. Okay, I have to work these guys down a little bit. They're using more armor than I am. Uh, I kind of want to heal myself, because this poison is going to be a problem. There we go. You meant to stream another 47 hours? No, 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 no. The subathon includes sleeping time. But I'm not going to be doing a sleep stream, so therefore you guys get extra time on top of that. Oh, let's just attack normally. Wow, that's so much armor to go through. This is going to be a long fight, chat. A long one. Oh, as I take a little bit of damage. Okay, oh, okay, that hurts. I might need to spend more mana. There we go. Nice. 
Nice, good kill. Who do I heal? There we go, main dude. Nice. You didn't play around? What would that make you? I'm a cat snow. Catfish snow? Catfish snowman, that's what I am. Priest is dying, that is bad. I need to guard here. Need to heal myself as the priest. Uh, 14 versus 19. 3 out of 14 is roughly 4 point something per heal. 5 for 19 is less than that. So the most cost efficient is this one. Also, I gave myself a 20? All because of sacred scripture. Gives me more heals. Just barely went through his block. Great. But we're whittling them down, chat. That's the whole point of the iron sand and dark armor combo. We whittle them down. They can't beat us. And I'm not wasting too much mana, although I did kind of waste a little bit of mana in this fight, but it was warranted. This is not an easy fight. Oh, he went with a heal. <laughs> in terms of armor. Yeah, not a smart choice, buddy. Because I win. Okay, this is our first real challenge. That was a hard fight. Uh, I could heal the bros. I could get more souls or I could get some more mana. I'm going to be honest. I need more mana. If I run out of mana, I'm dead. If I run out of health, I can just revive people. And heal them during the fights. I think mana is a super important currency in this game. Ooh, what's that? Defeat all bosses before... It... What do you mean, all bosses? What's the circle behind me to represent? Oh, that's the amount of hours. Sorry, my face is in the way. That's how many hours are left on the... Um on the floor. So if I run out of hours, we lose. But yeah, more currency, exactly. Always more currency. But yeah, there's five hours left, and that means how many turns we have to finish this area. What is that? Gain a random relic and healing rewards. Oh, we could do that. That'd be so nice. The usual snow stream style? Yeah, just not having a snowman here. Exactly. Just me being invisible. It works. Okay, let's just go for this boss. I think the boss early is fine. I don't see a problem with this. Whole team will be forced into this battle. Interesting. So I can just leave? God, that's going to be an annoying fight. I think I just... I don't think I'm going to get to this thing within the... I mean, I have five hours. The human you hired is back that rustled my jimmies. Hey, hey, hey. Your jimmies don't need to be rustled for too much longer. Okay, I guess everyone goes and fights the boss now. I think we're, I think we're at a good stage. Maybe not. What is that? The dude's holding a pillar with gems and... Oh dear. Maybe I should have healed up before the fight. I don't like preemptive strike, dude. He's too fast. Mm-hmm. Okay, chat. Interesting times. 
call for interesting measures. That's a big dude. Stefan, I hope you had a good nap. Oh, he's preparing for a fancy attack. He's got double action. My priest is almost dead. Oh no, I may have been a bit too cocky getting to this fight shot. Let's go deadly precision here to set up this kill. I need to go flurry strand slam. Okay, okay, don't hurt me. Blessing is a little bit of healing. There we go. Keep up, priest. You got to do this. Oh no, priest is gonna take the big hit. No, he just buffed. He's just buffing them. And my archer's dead. Um. Um. That can't be good, chat. I'm just gonna say that right now. That can't be good. He summons the minions! And she's dead again. <laughs> God, the other fights were so easy with this combination of teams. I thought I was going to be fine. I should have used up all my hours. I should have gone for that extra relic challenge. I should have gone for extra loot. Holy crap, this dude is insane. And this is the first floor. I'm out of mana. Do I have any items I can use? No, that's outside of combat. He's not playing around. Yeah, I should have played chess, exactly. Okay, we heal main dude and see if we get a reduction. Damn, the fact that he hits an AoE, man, and he kills his own minions. I like that he kills his own minions, but he's got to stop. And he's slowly getting more strength, too. Which makes it impossible to deal with him. Am I just meant to ignore him? No, I can't. I can't. He just hits so freaking hard. That was something else. Sympathy for your suffering. I'll be taking your soul now. Nothing shall be wasted. I didn't do too bad, did I? I got three points, meta points. Oh, and my characters level up between fights, between games. That's really cool. Will my West weapon turn to relic someday? That'd be nice. Oh, we unlock new things. Apply three turns of Blunted. Don't know what that is. Vulnerable at the beginning of each turn. That's very nice. Increases the damage they take by plus one. Gain one power when using non-damaging skills. Okay, very nice. So there's some meta progression in this game, too. I like it. I like it. New game, Abyss Seminary. Fair enough. Let's try it again. Let's try it again, chat. Now, do we keep the same team or do we switch it out? <laughs> Unlock after clearance, like I'm gonna do that. Now that I see how freaking unpainful that is. Marlo, thanks for the reset at tier 124 months, two year sub anniversary. Congratulations, nine months streak. Face cam? What, what face cam? Where's the face cam? 
<laughs> Welcome to the stream, man. Welcome to the subathon. We're still doing well. We just got under 48 hours. Sheesh. It's just going to keep pumping itself back up, isn't it? Uh, I, I do like this team composition. I think it's really good for taking out big targets, defending and healing. So I might go back again just because we've been slowly leveling them up. I just have to be more careful. Gain one relic refresh. Gain one additional use of revive. Gain fragments. I like the fragments. I'm going to be honest. Like I didn't know what they were before, but now that I do, I think the fragments are really nice. So instead of upgrading my normal frag, my normal relic, like one of these, I can go again. See, this is nice. But so is this. We know that the Goblin King doesn't do debuffs. You need Goblin Slayer on my team? I do, I do. You know what? I think I go Colossal Jizo. We go insane defense this time. 15 pens range all enemies, every five normal attacks. That's nice. I gotta go Torture's Whip. Torture's Whip's just too good. That's Pen Nib. This is the bonus damage. Gain one BB per each turn when the number of power stacks on the friendly field is greater than 10%. See, King's Row was very nice, but I'm not stacking power very much. I think Torture's Whip's really good. Yeah, I'm going to be Giga Block. That's what I am going to do, chat, 100%. And this time, I'm going to go for... That is an Altar of Magic, so I'm going to go with Priesty Lady. You're going to go to the Altar of Magic, and you are going to... Increase your magic attack by one. Very good. And now we fight. Mm hmm. Okay, so, lady, we're attacking normally. And that's a guaranteed kill because of the Thorn Whip. Then we take one hit, and then we just win. Three damage? Easy. We just do full-out attacks. Nice aggression. Do, 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 do. Plus four to hit is great. Thorn Whip is good. But it doesn't help against bosses as much. Extra movement, Fruit of Life, Magic. Uh, let's just go extra movement, I guess. Twin Sun's going to sleep. No worries, you have a good sleep. Thanks for hanging. And we'll catch you in the next one. Whole team will be forced into the battle. I save an hour? Yes! If one of my bros is faster than the rest, I can just force boss battles. That's so good. Sleep who allows it? I know, right? I know, no one's allowed it. Uh, let's go charge shot on... Yeah, just a mage. We need to get rid of these mages. Uh, because I don't have the thing that makes them choose me instead. I'm just going to go for pure damage, chat. Uh, what's up to here? Yeah, it's not a bad idea. Um, I've got the chips that are on the down there. Those ones. Yeah. Thank you, dear. Uh, there's also the salsa in the fridge. That would be great. I got chips. Corn chips are great, chat. Just a basic snack. Uh, let's go with Sudden Slash. 10 damage. Or should I just go... Just normal 6 damage, because then I can guarantee the kill with Lady without wasting mana. Yeah. Five damage is not bad. We easily get healed after this fight, I think, when we switch between here and the next area, so I don't have to worry too much about taking damage, although... I can't be too cocky. Beautiful crit. Beautiful kill. 
Do I heal here? Probably just do a holy light. Because we do heal a little bit of mana in between as well. Ah, uh, yeah, I should heal. <laughs> as expected, he's being a pain. Okay, good kill. I didn't have to heal. Healings for the weak. That That is very true. Okay, thank you, dear. And we learn revive. Nice. We'll have to add that from the merchant. And we get extra movement, extra souls, extra life. I think we got extra souls here. It's not much, but it's something. Uh, Infernal Con, thanks for the follow, man. It's been about time. It has been about time, and I appreciate it. Glad you've been enjoying, man. And I appreciate the follow. It makes a difference. I have to use my lovely spoon. There we go. Got it. Very nice. Salsa and dip. Salsa is the dip. Chips and dip. Chips and dip is good job. I'll mute the mic just for a second so I can have a couple of snack bits because it's going to be loud with the crunching. Okay, have a good sleep, Sword Ghost. We'll see you next time, man. There we go. Snack time over. What are we choosing, chat? Dark armor's broken. Miss Magic Crystal's broken. I've got to go dark armor. I have to, I have to hopefully find magic crystal later on. This thing was really good. One of those things, the weird things, is so soundless social eating stream. That is weird. I do agree. But I didn't want you guys to hear all the crunkling and crackling. Chips are always so noisy. Yeah, we got to go with armor here. But we'll try and use our refreshes to find that minus three mana at the first turn. Because that'll be nice. Uh, max HP, max MP. Good. Oh, that scroll wheel is rough. Merchant's here. There is a treasure on this map. Now remember to get to the treasure before we get to the merchant on round two, which is where we are. So, priest has seven movement. Nothing there. There is a fight. What are these? Are these bats? Armor breaker exploit weakness. Oh, I deal with armor on my bros constantly. I think I have to skill these dudes. 
No, I only do nine? Ah, I don't do enough damage to kill them. Hate people in the, eating in the mic? Yeah, me too, Saxon, 100%. That's why I don't like... That's why you guys don't really see me eating on stream. That's why I've really tried hard not to be like, oh, I'm just going to have lunch on stream now. Because you guys are like, oh, why don't you guys just eat on stream? I'm like, I don't like eating on stream. It's a horrible sound in the mic, and it's just weird. I did have Subway this today on stream, which is fine, because Subway is not that noisy, and it's not that bad. But usually, usually it's not great. We don't see you eating on stream because you don't normally have a face cam. I mean, that's not also wrong. That's not wrong in the slightest. <laughs> okay, five damage. Now let's go with the cheap shot. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Plus four souls is not really worth it. Fruit of life is worth it. Doesn't usually have a face. Yeah, no, I only stole a face for today's stream. It, it wasn't too hard to do, though, chat. Surprisingly. I found the boss room. Whoops. Which means I haven't found the treasure room. Hmm. Hmm. Like Leatherface? Yeah, yeah, Leatherface did a good job. Except the fact that people didn't really notice that it was just leather this whole time. Found the treasure chest! Let's go! Soul currency. Relic fragments. Brand new relic. Oh, 10% lifesteal? None of the- I don't have burn on the team, I have to go for the 10% lifesteal. Not really the best relic, but it's something. Not the best. Okay, let's go and... I could go and do this fight. I kind of want to do that fight. But I kind of want to do the boss as well. Okay, time to go to the merchant now that we have money. Please give me a good relic option. Whetstone is good. Magic Crystal! I'm buying that, 100%. Let's go! Uh, we can also embed Revive. I'll embed that into the tank like I did last time. I think that's still a good call. Now, here's the other question I need to ask. And that is... Do I waste an hour here, or do I jump to the boss immediately? And do I hate this scroll wheel? Yes, I do. Six movement. I can get the two of them to fight. Yeah, okay, let's do this. Oh, that's an annoying fight. It's two versus three, though. But I get to use a man at the start of the turn. Takes six damage, it's kind of annoying. Blunted, ouch. Six times two. Oh, that could have killed the full health one. Why didn't I think about that? Oh, this is a really bad fight for me. Oh, we have life steal. I can slowly heal. But I'm still taking damage at the same time. I will win this. But not without taking at least a little bit of damage whilst we're here. Okay, we healed as much as we could. We still win. We can also just heal after the fight. 
Because 10 currency is not much. Yeah, yeah, that's fine, that's fine. Easy fight, easy fight. Um, but then one, two, three, I can't... Oh, it's another fight. Uh... I guess, I guess I could do it. It's two against one. Oh, it's just a blowpiper. That's fine. That's fine. I was worried. Stupid poison, though. Nice. Double tens. Easy kill. Extra AP, Fruit of Life. I'm going with Fruit of Life. And then we can probably heal. Oh, okay, that's not what I wanted to do. I didn't want to waste an entire hour. Let's go for the boss, then. Because that brings everybody here. Okay, that wasn't too bad. Not sure if doing those little fights made a difference. I'd like to feel it made a difference, but we'll have to see in the long run. Six times two is 12. And it's going to be more than six because... It didn't calculate Torture's Whip for the second hit. Oh, that's bad game mechanic. Oh, it should have calculated it. Because it procced it below 50% health for the first hit. Ah, oh, that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. I was hoping it would have procced. Okay, for the moment, plus two armor is good for everybody. That means I don't need to really put too much effort into figuring out who wants to survive and who doesn't. Damage is split fairly evenly. And I'm slightly healing a little bit. Is that my face cam? Wait, what face cam? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, let's go for another charge shot. We should heal after this uh, encounter. Sudden Slash is 10 damage, which should turn into 14. Nice. Now look what I thought you did. Uh, I am technically a snowman. This is just the puppet that I have held by strings. There are a few strings above this person's head. So don't worry about it too much. Uh, let's go with the reveal location of the boss enemy. Nice. Lip syncing is really good. It is. It is pretty good. Yes, Iron Sand is good. Yep, Iron Sand. Love it. Absolutely love it. We need a horror game now that's fast cam? Yeah, I know. I know, right? You guys need to see me flip out completely. It's a paid actor. <laughs> it's a paid actor's good. Extra attack, extra defense. May magic attack. Good. Okay, the merchant's here. I don't have enough money for the merchant, so I will ignore him. Walter's strength is free stats, which I really do need. So I guess we just move together. Uh, yes. Easy fight. We take those. Ah, oh, he's not dead. Now he is. Good stuff, extra fragments, extra hour in the dungeon sounds pretty good because I don't need anything else. Love to see it. Ooh, there's a fight here. Who has the extra movement? She does. One, two, three, four, no. 
we go here, we fight against the two wolves. The wolves are really annoying because they're fast. I don't like it. But I do like that I can do this and kill them in one shot now. It's kind of nice. So in the previous room, in the previous level, was not really great, but this level is pretty good. Uh, four extra currency or extra health. Extra health is nicer. I think the boss is going to be like here or in that bottom left corner. Yeah, let's just go to the right. See what we can get here. Nice free attack at the beginning of the game. We take a hit as expected, and he's dead. Good, we're getting easy fights. I worry about the hard fights, that's the thing. The hard fights is what's going to really screw us over. Yeah, I know, I know. Your boss is going to be a problem. Increase her attack. Yes, she needs it. The archer needs more attack. Okay, how much more movement do I have? I really don't have much movement. Okay, interesting. I need to find that boss. Do I want to rest? No, there's no need to rest. There he is. Yeah, I thought so. Do I want to go to the shop? I may as well. Let's see what we have. Because there's nothing else to do on this floor. Bloodlust necklace. Each crit heals for 2 HP. I'm literally one currency off of buying it. I can buy a new class relic. <laughs> At the beginning of turn, Samurai's armor no longer falls on its own. That's pretty good. But I'm trying to think about the boss fights. What did I struggle in the boss fight with? AoE. This is like Slay the Spire with three people. Yeah, it is. It's like Slay the Spire with three people. Archers and normal attacks always deal crit hits and restore 10%. 10%. Always deal crits. These are wild. Priests convert any healing above a max into armor and applies the guard. I like that one already. We've seen this one. I like these shards. All of these are good. So this part with non-card combat. Yeah. It's with relic combat. That's how you play it. And with mana points instead of cards. That's how it is. Uh, beginning of turn, samurai armor no longer falls on its own. I already had to have a buff for the samurai. I want all of these. What's going to give me the best chance of survival? I don't have the one where armor attracts the enemy. I had that last run. So I think... Wait, this target only works on normal attacks. This doesn't help with her special attacks. So it's not as good as it could be, even though it still is good. The priest converting is really good. Let's go to Samurai. I think Samurai is ever so slightly better than the priest. Ever so slightly. It's 50 points to get the next one. Ooh, that's expensive. I already have one revive. Can I sell this revive? Shush alarm, I know. 
I can sell that for 200. Which means I could buy the Bloodless Necklace. Ooh, but I can't do anything here with it. Oh, but I want that Devil's Pock Watch. I'll buy the Bloodless Necklace. Let's do that. Okay, I'm happy with this shot. That was actually a really nice shot. Okay, right, let's go boss fighting. Okay, it's gonna be next floor that we really need to ramp it up. I need to get a crazy combo breaker. Okay, I don't like that you attack twice. I don't like this boss. Uh, charge shot, let's get him down to a low health. Guaranteed to heal up on that. Uh, we guard, which does two damage there. Uh, and then do I guard here or just kill it? I gotta kill it. Yeah, that's nice. Mm-hmm, that's fine. That's fine. You attack the samurai, that'd be really nice. Thank you, yes. Yes, he's attacking people with armor. I don't have the thing that attracts them to armor, do I? No, I'm just getting lucky. I like that. Deadly Precision gets him down to three health. Yes. Yes. What happens if I upgrade this Bushido helmet? I wonder what it'll do. Maybe it gives me more armor. Wait, he's dead. Why is he still flying? Oh, no. That's a glitch. I already found, I've already broke the game shot. Okay, can you stop hurting my my lady here? My lady. Thank you very much. Holy Light is going to do 12 damage. Uh, sure, why not? <laughs> the corpse is flying. So funny. Look at that. I love this armor. It keeps him alive. It doesn't keep everyone else alive, kind of. So it's kind of annoying. It's workable, though. I'll work around it. Fortify. Interesting. I don't know what that does. Reveals the location of all non-boss enemies. Nice. I'll grab that. Decrease MP cost by 1 and deal 15% extra damage when your character is at full HP. There it is. Warden's Ward. That's so much more important, I think. But I guess full HP characters are important too. Each crit applies one power. That's also so good. Oh, they're all good. I'm going with the tank build though. So I think I need Warden's Ward. Yeah, I need Warden's Ward. Oh, but the other two are so good. Because I'm guaranteed crits for girl. Yeah, I had the whetstone, should have gone King's Robe. Yeah, I might have gone King's Robe. We'll have to see. We'll have to see if I made the right decision. I just wish I had a better choice when I got the Crimson Guard, because I don't love the Crimson Guard for this team at the moment. And for the current build, if I could switch that out, that'd be better. Also, plus two armor per turn with the Bushi Helmet, plus one. Oh, I see. Interesting combination. This is definitely the tank combination. I like it. Uh, what floor is this? This is the fourth floor. We've got six hours to complete it. There's a gate of challenges which we do want to fight, which is over here. There is a altar of speed, a random event, and a heal, and a merchant. We don't have tons of money. We have a little bit of money, but not a ton. Okay, let's try this. Nothing in here. There's a fight. Easy fight. He does preemptive strike, which is annoying. Six damage. He crit. Eh. I heal that health back anyways because of 10%. Easy. Nice! Try and get most of what we need from here. Uh, extra souls or heal? Let's go with the extra souls. 
420 blaze it. Got ourselves 420 souls. Ooh, more fights. We'll take it. Who has the most movement? You do. So we go and fight these dudes. Are we going merchant first? No, we're not trying to go merchant first. We'll try and go southeast first. 13 damage is good. Dang it. There we go. Extra shielding is very nice. Uh, I can heal myself because it's the first turn. I don't have the buff thing. I still have poison, which is annoying, but I'll live with it. Wait, the armor attraction thing didn't work super great this turn, but that's fine. Deadly Precision gets him down low, and then he dies. Nice. Keeps us high health, 56 plus extra souls. We'll get extra souls. Every little point might get us a cool relic, so I'm hoping. Okay, girly, you go down here. What is that? Is that the Battlemaster dude? No, it's the mage. Okay. That's not bad. I still think we go charge shot onto the wolf because he's annoying. Nice kill. And then I think we go fury slam. Because that gives me more shielding. Well, it gives me enough shielding. Take a little bit of damage and we're fine. Nice. Nice. The mage is all right. He's not too crazy. And then we get extra souls. 20% is nice. So six extra souls. Actual snowman face on stream. I know, right? Crazy. Got barony, and I love it, but goddamn trolls. Barony. I've heard of that. Oh, yeah, that's the one that's like Minecraft, but it's not Minecraft. I've seen that game before. Yes, yes, it's like Minecraft in first person. And you wander around, you fight pixelated uh, magical enemies, all sorts of things like that. You can choose your type of character. Yeah, is it trolly like like the community I'm assuming you're talking about? Or do you mean like actual troll trolls? As if Minecraft isn't first person. You can be third person in Minecraft. <laughs> <laughs> the actual enemies. Fair enough, man. Fair enough. Okay, random event. Please be greed. No, it's not greed. Goblin and friends. A group of goblin children played with the crystal in their hands. They laughed as they tossed purple gold crystal into the air. The crystal started to spark in midair. It noticed and approached me. Bargain, snatch, leave. Chat, we could just steal it. They're just kids. We've been murdering goblins this entire floor. I don't want to give them money. Slaughtered them all. We got holy healing plus one. We lost five HP. Easy! We slaughtered the kids, and the priest slaughtered the kids. She did it herself, chat. The priest slaughtered the kids. Yikes. Very priest-like. Okay. Um, that's where the thingy is, so I need to go this way. Oh, that's a hard fight. Altar of Speed. Okay, I need to go Altar of Speed with this dude. Because I need my samurai to be faster to get the armor before the enemies get to him. What is that? That is a Blowmaster Goblin. Oh, I don't have much movement left, so I'll go back here just to be safe. One hour's pass, it's fine. It's actually Goblin Slayer. Exactly, the priest is going pretty hard at the moment.
Okay, now the problem with this is... Can I cancel it? There we go, okay. Problem with that fight is you think that everyone needs to be there at the same time. Okay, we got this dude who should be easy to kill. As we're all faster than him, easy stuff. Charge shot, nicely done, 17 crit. Fury slam. And then we go for a holy light. Nice, we heal two damage because of the crit. He does nothing to us because he's horrible with against armor, which is great news. And then he's gonna die. Gom Slayer likes the stream, exactly. Souls, relic fragments. Extra souls! Sure, why not? Okay, uh Rafael is an extra hour in the dungeon. Do I want to use that now? Probably not. I don't want to keep these items, because I need more relics. I need to get to 50 relics to get a new relic thing. Okay, let's go over here and over here. I want this challenge thing. Tiga, how was lunch, man? Hopefully it was a good lunch. I kind of think it's going to bring everybody into this room, but I want everyone to be here just to be safe. Oh, uh, what's that? Oh, uh, what's that? Oh, dear. I think I need to kill the totem. Double action for the first dude? Oh, I don't like that. I know what this guy does. This guy just does shielding. I think I gotta get rid of the totem. In flame means he's probably gonna burn us all. Nice crit. Nice! Got rid of him. Now I don't even know what he's gonna do. It's fine. Okay, we take five damage. That's easy. Oh, plus three? Five plus three is not amazing, but I'll live with it. Holy light. I need to get rid of main dude, I think and leave the back dude to do nothing. Wait, KFC got some spicy chicken? Nice. KFC spicy is good because it's crunchy. Is he going to buff everybody? Yep, he's going to keep buffing every turn. He's got to go, boys. Yeah, down to half health. We're doing some good damage. Don't want to use mana here? No, let's just guard. Oh, we went for the AoE. Fancy. But hey, I get to heal every time I attack, so that's kind of nice. He's going to buff again. Yep, that's fine. I mean, it's getting annoying, but I'll survive. Nice. Big dude's dead. Now it's just the tanky dude, and we're set. He's going to go for the middle. Ooh, that actually hurt a little bit. Okay. Deadly precision, very good hit. I think we guard here and then heal. Yeah, because I need that. Because he's kind of getting through my armor, which is a little bit annoying, but it's only because he has the plus three strength to him. That's the only issue I really have right now. But now with, um, he's under Torture's Whip range, he can die. Nice fight. 200 souls. 8 fragments. I get another flare, but I don't want to. Oh. I guess I go extra AP? So I don't really need them, man. I only used a little bit. Let's go the extra movement. Is the unlurk thing a yet? Yes, the unlurk thing is a thing now. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay, chat. We can get whetstone. Whetstone's good here. Quill is nice. Every five attacks, you get plus 15 damage. But what's that? That's like plus three damage per hit. 
But it has to be normal attacks, and I'm not using normal attacks. So therefore, I can also just refresh. Oh, but I think Whetstone's a good pick. Because there's nothing else I desperately need. I think I go Whetstone. Yeah, we'll grab it. Not some sound meter I go through story rich amount of EG3? That's fine. You enjoy that. Voice echoes from deeper underground dungeons. Oh dear. That doesn't sound good. Uh, the boss fight's here. The merchant's here. I have enough money to go to the merchant. I will go to the merchant, but I don't have many hours to get through this. So I think I just go straight north. This dude's not going to give me anything. The rest of the dungeon's probably not going to have anything. So let's just go group effort to the merchant. I know I'm running out of time. Game on two hours left. Okay, Merchant, what you got, buddy? This better win us against the boss. I can sell you Holy Healing and Fortify. Oh, I need Fortify. No, 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 no. I need Fortify. Increased damage reduction when defending by 25%. And all my samurai is going to be doing in these fights is defending. That's huge. Okay, what's the relic you're giving me? Stack of burns, no. Or straight HP ally with those who be at the end of the battle. At the end of the battle? I could rotate these for 200. I don't have enough for another class relic. What's the class relics? They would have been really good, wouldn't they? When the priest doesn't attack or damage, all your characters gain plus one attack and reduce damage before the next action. That's kind of nice. Aim shot upgrade. Samurai gets three armor every turn. I need eight. Eight more fragments, chat. Snow, I have something of great importance that I, Snowbot, must now let you know. Snowbot, what's up? Happy Snowtone, maybe long and filled with will to finish it. I hope so, man. Everyone, I have a confession to make. I am Mr. Beast. <laughs> that actually sounds convincing a little bit. Just a little bit. Thanks, Tiga. I may I may just be Mr. Beast. It's a possibility. Increased damage by 10% when HP is below 30%. That's bad. 3%, 3 MP to all teammates. Magical sharing. That's pretty good. The follow-up seems pretty bad. Heal a single target, no. Get one defense when embedded? I don't know what that means. What's embedded? Uh, the herbs is pretty bad, so let's refresh these. That's kind of nice. That's kind of nice. Restore 2 HP and MP when defending. I'll buy it. I'm just, I'm focused on defending, chat, that I need to remember to fight. 80% of damage to all enemies. That's kind of nice, too. Oh, wait, I know what embedding is. Embedding is this. Oh, I could have gone for the defense one, maybe. That's fine. Oh, the refresh refreshes everything in the shop. Oh, I didn't know that. Fair enough. Dang, newbie, welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. How's it going? Let's see if I can do that correctly. There we are. How is RimWorld, man? Good to see you. You've come at a great time. We're doing our Snowathon, Subathon, same thing. Same difference. Good to have you, man. We're going for a decent amount of time, as you can see here. I think I sell the Holy Healing chat. What, wait, what, why would I sell the Holy Healing? Do I get anything good out of it? Uh, not really. Mm, I see no benefit. Because if I sell it and then buy, like, Crystal for 3 HP or Crit for plus 2, I, I, it's not enough. 
not enough to warrant my purchasing. So let's wait till the next merchant. Just, just we'll pace it out. I still think Dream River was the best purchase we got here. We did a Sand Inspire Colony. It was so fun. Hey, happy to hear it, man. Love to hear the snowman sort of steal the snowy sort of themed things. So glad to hear it. Hopefully you had lots of presents for your lovely, lovely raiders. Um, and hopefully they um, ate all the coal. <laughs> uh, glad to hear it. Welcome to Mr. Beast stream. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Drunk Santa. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, you could definitely have a lot of drunk things happening. Well, you came at a great time. We're playing a new game. We were playing Battle Bows earlier because we have a snowman mod that we want to play around with. But we're playing this game in between. And uh, it's kind of like Slay the Spire, but without cards and with three bros in your party. And you come at a great time because we're going back to the boss fight that we died at horrifically last time. So. Yeah. I'm totally feeling safe. Oh, chat, hold me, please. Oh, wait, 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 before we go into the boss fight. Wait, 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 chat, wait, 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 wait. Do I buff the helmet? And the Colossal Jizo. Before I go in, and Prediction, yeah, Prediction for sure. Do I buff them? Or do I save the points for after? The, I think I, I need to buff them. I can't be greedy, can I? We got our asses kicked last time. Yeah, I think I have to buff them. But yeah, definite prediction and dang to me. Thanks for the RNG luck. I do appreciate it. We are definitely going to need it. Uh, start prediction. It's just going to be Dewey win. Because it doesn't matter if a bro dies or not, because I have a way of reviving them and stuff. Okay, so there you go, chat. There's the prediction. Traces is back. Welcome. It snowed first time. Snow over the night. Hey, congratulations. The more snow, the merrier in the world. We're happy to have it. Okay. It should be the same boss as last time, right? Yeah, it's a big dude. Oh, he's huge. All enemies deal 25% more damage. Its special attack requires one other enemy to unit to be alive. Oh, so you're meant to kill the minions. Oh, that's the mechanic. Damn, I need to be good at killing minions then. How? How do I kill all these minions before he gets two attacks? I, I don't see that happening. You came at a bad time, Drazis, because this, this is a tough fight. Big Chungus over here, yeah. He's going to be a problem. Well, we got to go charge shot to start, 100%. And that means we can get rid of Preemptive Strike Dude or the Mage. Um, 13 damage puts him within death range, or 17 damage puts him within death range. Uh, it means I can guarantee the kill here. No. I can go for Fury Slam into this dude. That gets him within killing distance. And then Lady Dude goes for the preemptive kill. Good. Sadly, doesn't waste any mana. <gasps> but we've got plus two strength now because of the, the Whetstone. The Whetstone is so good. Okay, he's going to set up a kill. So I need to do this chat. What's up, dear? Why did you give me a candy cane? It's leftover candy canes. <laughs> Thanks, dear. Uh, I guess I can, yeah, I can eat a candy cane whilst we're doing this part of the stream. <laughs> Thanks, sweetie. It's definitely not Christmas time yet, chat. What, it's still November. It's the 25th of November. Why am I eating a candy cane? I blame my wife. She's telling you I'm not being sweet enough? Yeah, I believe that. <laughs> okay, chat. So. Oh, hi, Mal. Okay, we got everything happening at once, chat. Oh, wait, this is hard to do. 
Candy canes are tasty. They are pretty tasty. Only issue with candy canes is if they don't taste pepperminty enough, and this one just tastes like candy. There's no peppermint in this one. It's just literally candy. Snow got distracted at 100 hours, please. Yeah, I know, right? Isn't it right, Meow Meow? You're the distraction. The candy cane's the distraction. It's not that great. It's just one of those cheap ones, which is fine. I just wished it was the peppermint. I know, why would you have a non-peppermint? It's just one of those dollar store ones, which is perfectly fine. But I'm just not a sweet tooth, so I don't think I'm going to finish this. But I'll try and keep it up for a bit. It also makes it hard to talk. Okay, I'll put that down for a bit. Uh, deadly Precision. This dude needs to die. Then, we need who to die. What's up, dear? Yeah, of course it was a cheap one. I know, it's fine. Cheap candy canes are fine. Uh, who needs to die first? I think Mage needs to die. So we kill Mage. We take four damage. And then we kill this dude, and that means he can't do his fancy attack, right? Yes! Yes, we figured out the mechanic! We totally did that wrong the first time, shot. 100% did that wrong the first time, and we get punished for it regardless. Okay, we need to charge shot this dude. Uh, we need to start stacking up some guard. And then we need to heal ourselves. Because we took a really big hit from him. Now he's going to make new, f new minions? He didn't make new minions? Oh, he did. Okay, I thought he was. So now we go Deadly Precision and we hit... 18 on the... Dang it. Maybe the Mage. So then we attack the 9 health. Yeah, see how that works. It's doing all right. You can do what you want, Stefan, exactly. Put the candy in the slap of the table. <laughs> it's fine. If I get tetanus, so be it. Also, wow, that hurt. Uh-oh, I'm gonna get hurt a lot. Can I even kill so, this dude? I have something of great importance that I, Snowbot, must now let you know. Snowbot, speak. Chat, did you know that my favorite meal is coolicles? No, chat, it's not. I swear it's not. You can't believe them, chat. Oh my goodness, this is hard to deal with. How do I guarantee the kill? Thirteen, nine. No! I think I need to go for this kill. No, I didn't get lucky, chat. I didn't get lucky. That's 15 damage. It's not enough. Nah, you gotta be kidding me. No. This is gonna hurt. Here's the hit. I was one damage off of that not working. You're freaking kidding me. Literally one damage, chat. Uh, I'm out of mana. Fudge. Oh, uh, I don't have a second revive, do I? No, I don't. 
Oh, this is bad. This is really bad. I've lost my damage dealer. How are you meant to win this fight? You're meant to do what? Like 60 damage? No, you're meant to do like 80 damage every turn in order to win. Oh, I forgot you can still keep using BP, so I should be trying that as well. Okay, there's a good heal. Just get good? Yeah, I know. It's This is painful. I was one damage off of not dying to this. I think I maybe did one thing wrong, but... God, this first boss is a pain in the ass. You know what I'm going to do, chat? I'm going to go triple damage. Congratulations for those who didn't believe. Freaking heck. I just needed that one extra damage. So... I'm going to go with the mage. I'm going to get rid of the priest. I don't know. I think she's holding us back. I'm sorry, lady. Let's go, mage. I think it's a DPS race in this game. Snowball inflation is going to be insane. It is. It's going to be insane. Uh, challenge to desperation. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Um, five relic fragments is important. I think that's the right play. What do you get for leveling up? I think the characters just get slightly stronger in between runs. There's a bit of meta progression. Why'd you call the priest a lady? Because she was... No, I think that was a female priest. According to my... Thought so. Samurai no longer loses armor on his turn. Very good. Archer attacks occur. One extra follow-up attacks of two damage. Fifty percent chance to apply a vulnerable when mage deals damage to an enemy. Maybe I go Archer buff. Have fun at dinner, though, lunatics. Have a good one. You don't call Lady Priestess Priestess? Yeah, I guess so. I guess you could. There's a way of calling it that way. You know what? I'm going to go with Elf buff this time. I think Priest is unisex, but I guess Priestess does count as well. I don't think the mage is the right call here. I think maybe the companion elf. Dark armor is good, but so is torturer's whip. I need torturer's whip. I need it. Okay, we got this. What class did you play in BG3? Nykrik says bard. Go Rogue. Rogue's always fun. Ooh, there's the free follow-up attack. Already a good bonus. But the follow-up didn't trigger on Torturer's Whip. That kind of annoys me. Hmm... Let's go with extra movement. Increase magical attack? No. I'm gonna make mage increase magical attack. And not skip an hour to make sure everybody goes in on the first round, which is good. If you have to strike, you're annoying, Mr. Buddy, then you know it. I could go Rain of Arrows, but I think Charge Shot is better. Unless... Does Rain of Arrows trigger on everybody? I would be very intrigued to figure that out, if that's the case. What's your abilities, Mage? Fireball is one damage every turn stackable on a single target. And then weaken targets. 
You know what? Just attack the dude so he dies. That's more important. Mage Bolt's fine. Then we're gonna get first strike by this dude. Yep, that's fine. I'm gonna have to try out this companion elf thing and see if it works the way I think it does. I'm not entirely sure if it does. Oh, let's go for a fireball here. Nice. Tempest Claire? Tempest Claire is a great. They do exactly what you want them to do. Destroy everything in front of them. Now, I do know that this follow-up probably benefits from strength, so I do want to go for strength build. Also, I'm thinking Mage is a good call, because that weaken seems like a good idea for boss fights. Nice. I feel a little bit weaker in terms of defense. Poisoned Blade, interesting. Let's go with Souls. Dark Armor I like, gain undead when having five or more power stacks triggered once. But I don't have power stacks. We can work on burn stacks now, chat. Surely we win this time. Yeah, the copium is real. Surely we win with burn. I'm still going archer build, though, chat. Oh, I already went with the archer thing. But what if I go burn build now? No, I'm going to refresh this. Hmm, I don't know. The Devil's Pocket Watch is pretty good. Gotta go Magic Crystal. Gotta go Magic Crystal. It's it's a good one. It's gonna help me with my mana costs in all the shorter fights and even the first start of the second the the boss fights. Oh, I didn't get what I wanted from those relics, so the refreshes weren't super amazing. Okay, the shop is here, which is not good. It's not where I wanted the shop to be. There's the boss fight. Of course it is there. No, 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 we're not going shopping just yet. No, I'm not going there either. Found the treasure chest, good. There's Bowman, and there's little dude. Do I want to fight the Bowman with just two characters? It's a little ballsy. He is really annoying. I think I just don't take the damage. I think I get the chest, go shopping, and get out of here. Yeah, let's not overdo it. Yeah. Don't overdose on the copium, exactly, don't do that either. What's the new relic? Restore three mana when you kill an enemy. Deal 15 penetration to enemy and five normal attacks. Each crit heals for two. I don't like these. I don't like these. I mean, I like dark armor, but one BP at the start of the battle is not strong enough. I gotta go Dark Armor, because I don't have a healer. 
<laughs> okay, let's go shopping. Or... Do I waste an extra hour to make sure that I get some fights here? Yeah, let's get some fights. One extra hour is worth it. Come on, big dude. Bring it. Yeah, the two damage still counts. Uh, Fury is four times two. Sudden is ten. We'll go with the ten. There's the fireball. Very nice. Now, the fire doesn't go away. He just stays on fire the whole time, doesn't he? That's kind of crazy. Yeah, that is kind of crazy. Now, here's the question. Flame Burst does what? Two stacks of burn? Okay, the Mage Lady is good. And he dies to burn on five damage. That's pretty good. Extra Relic Fragments. Uh, let's go extra AP. Yeah, I think I should try and kill as many enemies as I can. Do I want to fight the wolf by myself? Sure, why not? There's no way we lose this. Two wolves versus samurai, dude. Am I copiuming right now, chat? Oh, yeah, I am. I'm heavily copium. No, I don't kill him immediately! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I took way too much damage. Oh, the copium's real. This is a bit risky. This is just a little bit risky. But it's worth it for the loot, right? Yeah, totally worth it for the loot. Okay, uh, thingy's out of movement, so we go here. We fight. Please don't attack my... Ow! This dude, this dude's got to stop, chat. Sheesh. Okay, can I go Fury Slash to get more armor? Four times, eight. let's just go defend. Let's just defend. Fireball gets him almost killed. He goes first, he tries to kill me. He doesn't! Interesting. Okay, he's dead anyways. Okay, okay, we're doing fine. Uh, we can go for five souls or some healing. Let's go for the healing. Okay, we're fine, chat. And now we can go shopping. Okay, please tell me the shop is worth it. What you got for me, buddy? These are garbage. I mean, the quill's not bad, but it's out of my price range. Silent, give a single target 200% armor. Grant speed when embedded. Grant HP. Okay, so we remember what embedded is. Dispel all buffs from a target. No. Debuffs from a target. Healing. Pursuing shot is... Maybe that's worth it now? No, it's not worth it. Oh, new class relic. Um, that's not good. I don't like Huntress Mark because it's only 15% damage increase. And that's on crits and I can't crit all the time. And it only lasts for one turn. 
One stack per turn for each target. I don't think I like that. Upgrading the mage's weaken is kind of nice. No, it's not great though. Uh, I think I want to spend money to refresh these if I don't have anything to sell. I've got poison blade. All attacks apply poison. Okay, wait a minute, chat. Wait a minute, I just figured something out. Follow-up attacks. And Rain of Arrows. I can... S no! No! I, I had Snakehead! Where Poison triggers twice per turn! Oh, I need Snakehead so badly with this build. Fine, let's just refresh. Enemies with burn take extra damage. When picks up Archer gains 5 crit, applies 200 marks on all enemies to start the battle. Samurai single hits does 35% extra damage. Gar garbage. Absolute garbage. Iron Sand is nice, but no. No! Got scammed! I need the snake head! Damn it! Okay, I'm not spending money here. I need to save up for the next time. Okay, let's go for the boss fight. Let's hope we, we fix it up in room three, uh, floor three. Yeah, we might have to restart. There's a possibility of that. Especially if he's trying to kill my bro at the first beginning part of the fight. Calm down, buddy. Okay, it's arrow, rain of arrows right here. That should get three stacks of poison, right? Beautiful. Uh, then we need to guard here. And then we need to... No, I don't need to weaken, I need to fireball. Oh my goodness, this is such an overpowered combination shot. If only I had the snake. Okay, good thing the guard's working. Uh, arrow barrage is here. It's so nice. Look at the AoE damage. That's how we beat the boss. That's exactly how we can beat the boss. Okay, we took some damage there. That's fine. Poison and AoE and fire. It's so good. Uh, let's go use an extra hour in the dungeon. Where's the snake head? No, no. <sighs> Do I go iron sand? Do I go assault sphere? No, I go iron sand. Actually, I don't mind star tier, because then I can keep spamming... I can keep spamming the, uh... Reign of Arrows. And magic attacks. Yeah, let's just keep doing that. Constantly spamming. Rerolling be pain, I know, and I rerolled something that was good way at the beginning, and I didn't realize it. Yeah, we gotta learn the hard way, chat. Mm-hmm. Goblin statue. World spun around you, won't beside you shine brightly in the face. You look at the source, there's a stern looking. Uh let's salute the goblin statue. Archer gains extra HP. Invisible pressure washes over you. 
Loses 10 HP, but gains 5 max HP. I'll take it. I will happily take that. Easy stuff. Okay, let's get into this. We get Freeman at the start of the fight. Rain of Arrows is pretty good here. Nice poison. Uh, Sudden Slash gets you there. And then Fireball gets you there. Good stuff. Snow has a cam? What cam? No, no, it's snow. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Sakao. Good to see you, man. And welcome, Regime. Good morning, my man. Good morning, indeed. Uh, let's go with Fruit of Life, just to heal up a little bit. Ooh, what is that fight? That's a succubus. No, thank you. But I guess I'm gonna have to fight her anyways. Not pale enough to be a snowman? Oh, it's probably just the lighting. It's, it's very snowy in here today. Ah, poison. What is she doing? Not good, that's what I'm saying. She's not doing anything good. Let's go Rain of Arrows, do a little bit of damage. Don't do it. We block the attack, that's very good to see. Sudden Slash and he's dead, that means we get free mana. Fireball and Succubus will burn! If we buy another game like FTK2, will you play it in the subathon? Possibly, possibly. I wouldn't put some money on it. Because... I do have other things planned at the moment. But we'll see how it goes. Oh, she dies to poison and to fire, which is great. Eight extra souls, healing. Healing's good. I'll take the healing. But yeah, it depends on how long the subathon goes as well. That's the other thing. A lot of things depend on a lot of things. Down to seven hours is not too bad. Altar of Strength. I don't need it. I will use Girly for it. Ooh, she's sacrificing HP to get even stronger? Okay, I may have sacrificed a bit too much HP there. But plus two attack is pretty good. As long as I don't, you know, die. And there's the rest. So then she's fine. Easy 2v1. Yes, maybe. Yikes. Dude, bro, calm down. Calm down. There's the poison. There's the fireball. Yeah, extra DPS is counting, chat. It's doing well. Uh, six extra souls or the healing. The healing's a little bit better for us at this moment. Ah, found the boss room. That does make sense, doesn't it? Okay, so we found everything except for the boss. So then we need to go shopping for 403. I swear, buddy, if you don't sell me the snake. He's not selling me the snake, chat. And he's not helping me. These are the same things he's offered last time. I don't want it. 
But sacrificing is never too much. Exactly, exactly. But Davkul knows. He knows what we need. I don't want Hunter's Mark. Maybe I do want Hunter's Mark. Maybe the game's telling me to take it. Because I don't want to waste 200 points to refresh. There's no way I'm going to get what I want. What embed do I have? I've got Fortify. Uh, increased damage reduction when defending. Am I even going to use that? No, I'm kind of going off an offensive build. So I think I can just sell that. I, I know it's weird. I don't want to sell it. But it seems right. Also, I still can't buy these. These are useless to me, though. Fine. I'm going to go Starcatcher Bottle. Uh, it doesn't seem right. It just doesn't seem right. Two follow-up attacks of two damage is pretty good. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. We will have to see. Alright, get into the boss fight. Mini boss fight. Yeah, I might take a bit of damage in this fight, though. Yep. With a healer and a tank, I felt a bit better last time. Uh, do I want to go Rain of Arrows or Charge Shot? Because what does Charge Shot 2 do? It just gives you an extra 15% with a... Yeah, I don't feel confident. I don't like it. It's not that strong. I do have a backlog of bot games. I do, so that's that's the other thing. Mao. Yeah, no, don't go into the carpet, Mao. You come up here. Yes, and you can say hi to chat again. Uh, we need Rain of Arrows, I think, or Charge Shot Deadly Precision. 23 crit. See, the thing is, it applies under Mark after. It applies it after you do the crit. So it's useless. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Now confused to see humans still awake during her rounds is very concerned. Ah, she's fine. She doesn't need to be too concerned. Okay, is he gonna die to poison and fire? Yeah, he should he should die here. Yeah. Nice. Meditate, I think that's the free mana across the board. Healing potion's gonna be very helpful. But so is extra souls. Let's go potion. Shot we win. Oh my goodness. We got it. We got the freaking snake. Uh, I think we win now. From from a hopeless run to now a possible run. I think we win with the double procs with the AOE. Nah, this this is this is a chance. What's this? Altar of critical hit. Okay, I, I don't think I need it, but I'll grab it. And what's this? This is a battle of sorts. Okay, uh, I guess we're gonna move together. We have some time. Who has the extra movement? Ladyface does. We kill as much as we can. Okay, let's see how good this is, chat. Let's see how good this is. Watch this. Double trigger of poison, really good. But the fire damage, she's a bit slow. I need the mage to be faster. I really need her to be faster. It's good damage though, chat. Look at this. Wait, does the is it stack again? Can I stack this again? 
it only maxes out with three poison. I mean, double damage is double damage. I'm not complaining. Restore two movements to all party members. Ooh, I like emergency rations to move around the map. I like it. Oh, I also found the boss room. Uh, I wanted her to go for the altar of crit, didn't I? Do I use the emergency rations now? No. I can do it next turn. Whoa! Why is that so many enemies? Why is that so many enemies? Well, I do have a lot of AoE. Oh, it's because they're really low levels. It's annoying. But stop attacking my archer, man. Rain of arrows hit everybody. There's all the poison. Look at that damage chat. It's beautiful. It doesn't kill everybody perfectly though, but it does get them low. Uh, I think I stop one of these blade singers. I think I go for a fireball on the mage. And then he dies and then he dies. Stop attacking my lady. My lady. First soprano to strike keeps attacking her. You're a jerk and you know it. And now we do crazy rain of arrows and then we just win. Yup, and he's dead. I like it. Like, my previous party could not do that. Not in the slightest. Also, I need to heal. <laughs> Just a little bit of healing, chat. Oh, hello, dude, bro. Only one character can offer tribute. Ooh, let's not say we did. Okay, I know what I'm going to do, chat. I'm going to go over here. Here. Attack this bro. Charge shot is easy start. Gets the poison, gets the hit. Gets the hunter's mark, which is whatever. Fury slam is six times two. Sudden slash is six times two, but fury slam gives me extra armor. And then fireball, and then this dude's just going to be toasted. Look at that! As a damage over time, he took like 20 damage. 26 damage, according to my math. Insane! Absolutely insane. Sheesh. Okay, Archer Lady, you have some movement points. You go here, you rest up. Yeah, you rest up. Oh, it ended her turn. Dang it, that's not what I wanted to do. Dang it. Okay, so that was a mistake. Succubus up there. And then there's this fight over here. Oh, at least we know where the boss fight is, at least. Uh, okay, Sucky, uh, no, you lady, go here, get this crit thing up. Crit by plus four, that's very nice. Yeah, I kind of fight the succubus. She's not a hard fight. Skill with the rain of arrows? Yeah, rain of arrows is good because it hits them before they get their turn. Because it triggers the poison on both. She takes the hit. 
He takes the hit. I take a poison hit. But it only triggers once, which is good. Six times two with a Fury Slam. Very nice. Uh, we go for a Fireball. Easy kill. I need to heal up the team a little bit. So yeah, the Glass cannon -y type of build shot. We are slightly struggling in terms of survivability, but we're doing good damage output. We are on floor four. I need to do that challenger fight. Okay, no. How the BB run go? We're doing good. We're on day 20 and we're able to start getting into some decent fights. Okay, let's try and get the team together. All the merchants down here. Oh, I need that merchant. I hope this brings my whole team in. It does. Oh, I was worried it wouldn't. Okay, this fight's not too bad, as long as I don't take a big hit. Okay, he gave buffs that way. He doesn't give buffs any other ways. Rain of Arrows! It's poison time, chat. There we go. There we go. And we can Fury Slam the totem, because I think the totem is the scariest thing, even though I've never seen what it does. And then we fireball the totem so it dies. Perfect. Okay, there's the annoying AoE, but I don't care because I have dark armor. It's only if he starts buffing himself that's annoying. Okay, front dude. He buffs with shield instead of damage. I'm happy. I'm really happy with that. Uh, Fury Slam? Yeah, I gotta go Fury Slam here. How many dead bros? Nah, we didn't lose anybody. We're doing really well. That dude's dead. Five times two, that's 24 damage. Okay, my math was off maybe previously. 24 damage is insane, though. Okay, I kind of don't want to waste a mana here, but then again, I can. Gotta keep that poison high. Uh, Hunter's Mark, that I just, I'm really having buyer's remorse on that Hunter's Mark. I think it was a bad idea. I think Fireball is always a good play, though. There we go, he did. He did. Yeah, <laughs> you've got armor, buddy, but it ain't gonna help you. Ooh, beautiful, beautiful. Do I go for 43 Fragments or healing? We're gonna go into a boss fight. But I also need to go shopping. I'm going to have 1,200 souls. I'm going to go for the souls. I know, it's a stupid idea, chat. Characters deal 25 or 6 damage if you're the first character during the turn. So that's only if you're top of the turn order, I think. Reduce damage you have no armor. Tool damage every time your character gets armor. I think Iron Sand's the right play. Because it's just free damage, and I need more damage to be proccing. Let's go Iron Sand. Almost boss time. Also, we healed after that fight. I didn't need to heal. Why does the game never tell me you heal after these types of fights? That would be nice to know. Okay. I'm running out of time. I only have two hours left. I can see that as a problem, game. Thank you for letting me know. But it is time to go shopping. Let's go. Mm hmm. Life steal increased by 50%. Gain one BB at the start of the battle. Um, that's kind of okay. The class, class relics 50. I don't like these class relics. These class relics are bad. 
I think I have to cycle here. See, that doesn't work. Execution of Greaves doesn't work because that boss always goes first. Unless it says as the first character during a turn is you on your team. I don't I don't trust it. I don't trust it. That would have been nice. Holy Guard's nice. That would have been nice with Red Barrel, too. <sighs> I gotta cycle again. And then I don't have enough to... Selling Meditate. Fifteen penetrating damage to all enemies every five normal attacks. Or apply a vulnerable to a random enemy at the beginning of the turn. I don't do normal attacks. I do so many non-normal attacks. The Pocket Watch might be the right play. Multi-quiver would have been nice. Multi-quiver would have been nice. I never got this on any re-rolls. Oh, fine. I think I go pocket watch. Quill is really nice, but I'd have to take so much effort to proc it that it wouldn't be feasible for my current playstyle. I'm going to go with pocket watch. That's probably the best way for me to go. Okay. Uh, and then we just rush to the boss, I think. No, I'm one tile away. Uh, do I refresh and add two movement? Just to save an hour? No, because I think I still have the hour. Well, I should be fine. Yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. I've got one hour left. I know, one tile is what all I needed, but it's fine. I'm going to go scouting to see if there's any fights up here that were worth anything. No, that's not worth anything. No, that's not worth anything. Okay, we go into the boss fight. Um, we are completely full HP. I could try and run around the battlefield. Uh, I could also wait. I could upgrade one of these things before I go in. Yeah, I kind of need to. I need to upgrade Companion Elf. It's actually useful. And that doubles the damage again. Companion Elf again. I have to do it. I'm not getting anything else that I need. Oh boy. Prediction time? Yeah, 100%. Do we win this? I'm not sure if we win. I'm really not sure. Uh, it's it's the best we can do, I think. In all honesty, this is probably our best attempt. Because we have AoE damage now. We've got the snake. We've got the double procs. The sparkling eyes of youth. Twisted and made merciless. I have no eyes of youth no more. I am I am full despair, chat. Snow losing with poison. Hey, 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 you have to predict if I'm going to lose with poison shot. I like that a lot of people are thinking we can win. I think we might have a chance. This is the full DPS team. And we've beaten other things. Stefan thinks we're going to lose. Oh, thanks, Stefan. Thank you. My eyes are like Mr. Beast now. Yeah, yeah, I've got the whole copium eyes. It's just. The smile with no smiling eyes. <laughs> it's the way to do it. Okay, let's get into it, chat. Uh, Reign of Arrows is the only way we win. Because here's the fun part. The Vulnerable will tick on the dude. It does! It attacks... Vulnerable works for the follow-up attacks. And look, they're dead. Chat, look how good the poison is! 
It's over. It's already over. This is an insane combination. Easy. And then we burn big dude. Ow, that hurt. We're not over the hill yet. He's still going to attack us normally, chat. It's fine. It's not over the hill. Okay, he's buffed, but he doesn't go next. So then I need to go with charge shot, deadly precision. Attack the big dude. He's already half health. Holy freaking crap. Look at that damage. He's at 57 health. This is nothing, nothing like we used to, chat. It's over. He's got two stacks of fire. Is he going to die? He's on one health. Chat, I can't see the number. He dies to poison and the fire. He died in two rounds. <laughs> it's amazing. This build, I told you. I told you the poison and the fire would have been a good combo. It's just too much damage. Amazing. Let's do it, chat. I was playing too defensively. I mean, it worked. We were one damage off of beating him last time. Literally one damage off. But this combo is just way too good for damage. Damage over time? Yeah, exactly, Tiberius. I believe. Completely believe. Uh, we take the souls here, right? Because... Nothing else is going to help us on this level, so we take the souls. Okay. It's got to be Red Barrel, right? Or do I start pivoting into defense? I think I can start pivoting into defense, chat. Because I do enough damage. 5% damage is not a lot. No. I'm going to start pivoting. Restoring HP is nice. But it's not what I need. No, I'm going to pivot. The Archeal sounds good. I, I Hear me out. I agree. But I think I can find other ways of surviving on health. And the Arch is going to be using mana all the time all the time. She needs to do mana, so she's never going to do normal attacks. I think that's the weakest part of her build. She just doesn't do normal attacks. So I'm going to go with the Samurai to try and pivot into some tanking. Does the 5% affect the dot? Yes, but the dot doesn't do enough for 5% to make a difference. Maybe it does like one extra damage? I'm not sure. New skill slot unlocked on members. Let's go. We're on floor two. Crit increased by two. Nice. Okay, so we're in a new place we've never been before. That's the merchant. Ugh. And the boss has got to be here on this spot. There's no way it's anywhere else. So then we just go together. What is this? This better not be a rude awakening shot. Hello, who are you? Fountain Guardian. Three times 214. Let's just go with the normal big hit. That's a nice crit. Double seven. He's already half health. We outspeed him like a million times. Yeah, he's already dead. Okay, we're good. Is there a list of games that we played and when? I do have it on the Discord. Um, it's a generalistic schedule on the Discord. It's not perfectly accurate, but it's pretty good. Uh, let's go with extra movement speed. Easy fight. Okay, I like it. Uh, there's a fight up here. Do I want it? Yes. Those frogs? No, they're goblins holding water. Interesting. Uh, that goblin's already dead. Sucks to be him. He threw water on Snow, me. Have you been hydrating enough? Yes. Yes, I've been hydrating fairly decently. 
And dinner should be arriving soon. And I have a tea in front of me that I haven't touched yet. So that will be sorted. Uh, deadly precision. Beautiful kill. Let's go. Uh, do we go souls, fruit of life, magical water? Let's go with the souls. Kind of edge out a little bit more currency. There we go. Another guardian. Easy kill. The goblins need to pee, apparently. This is the water level. And we're using fire damage, so I'm not sure how good water versus fire, but... The vulnerable thing is amazing. It's just free damage. 11 times 2, like it... Because I do multi-hits on most of the things. He died! He already died! It's too easy. Let's go fruit of life here. Leave the tea cold and you'll be scold. What? No! It's cold tea is great! I love cold tea. I can't stand the hot tea as much. I'm addicted to the cold tea. Random event! Secret fountain, secret tunnel. A uh, melodic sound of dripping water is a common occurrence in the Azure Forest. On the surface of the stream are glowing insects darting from one place to another. You followed the water into the room. Streams of water were gushing out from within the walls as they fed a thriving little ecosystem inside the crevices on the walls. There were few delicious looking fruits hanging from the outstretched vines. You drag your exhausted body into the room and receive a short reprieve as, or reprieve. Reprieve? Reprieve? What was reprieve? As you enjoy the mystical scenery unfolding in front of you. Restore HP, get maximum, or get an item. I think maximum is better, because it gives you max MP as well. And I don't need items unless it's a relic. Get more poison relics? Oh, in the water area? Would they give me a poison relic down here? Cold black tea is a nay. Yeah, I only drink herbal tea. Get a bot to tell me how to pronounce reprieve. Yeah, I know. Um, Do we go for the item or do we go for the f maximum? We could gamble. It could be a good item. But if it's... Oh, no, 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 chat. If it's one of these consumable items, it's a waste. It's a complete waste. Because I already have full inventory and I can't use anything else. No, I think it's a bad gamble. Because if it's a relic, I want it. But if it's a consumable item, I don't want it. Yeah, I'm going to go with the max HP and MP just to not risk it. Yeah, that's. I think that's the safer play. Oh, and it only buffed the archer. Oh, because she was the only one in the event. Oh, okay. Well, that's still all right. The item might have been better, but I'm saving these for a rainy day. Uh, merchant's down here. I can put archer down there because she's faster than the rest. And then the U2 can go forward. And oops, I accidentally attacked an enemy. Eh, it's fine. He's easy. He does outspeed. No, he doesn't outspeed me. Okay, then we're fine. I just need to hit him with Fireball and he's practically gonna die. He'll do a damage to do what? He shielded himself? That's it? That's all you're doing? I should have used the fancy skill. Reach one HP in a battle, that's an achievement. I did it for the achievement, chat. Definitely did it for the achievement. I think he did it more than just shielding. Yeah, I think you might be entirely correct. I think there's a slight possibility he did a little bit more than just shielding. I think he showed that shielding back up our rear ends, if you know what I mean. Double-edged sword. Gain power when entering the battle with 75% or lower HP. Well, that's kind of how we're doing at the moment. Reduce damage when you have more armor. That's nice. 
class relic, samurai, extra damage. No, I don't any of those. I like the double-edged sword shot. I think that's going to be coming in handy. Especially with our current situation. <laughs> Just a little bit. Um, should I go heal the party completely up here? How many hours do I have? Six hours. That's not enough. Am I really going into this boss battle with 5 and 14 health? I'm going to heal the party. That's a waste of a heal, but I had to do it. Okay, that was not a bad fight, but I didn't barely outspeed them, so it was a bit of a risk. Let's, uh, Reign of Arrows, just so we can do damage. Summon a minion under certain circumstances, fair enough. Oh, he's duplicating himself, kind of. Well, that's annoying. Okay, I gotta make sure I get these guys low enough so they die to poison. Fireball the big dude so he stops splitting off into mitosis. Whoa, someone died and healed the rest of them. Healing upon death? Oh, that's what the water dudes do. Oh, that's annoying. That's so annoying. That prolongs the fight. I don't want to prolong the fight. That is really annoying. Is this game good? It's kind of like Slay the Spire, but not the Slay the Spire, because you have no cards. But it's it's like three bros in Slay the Spire. Oh, stop splitting off in mitosis. Stop. Okay, I need Rain of Arrows again. Uh, do I attack and guard? What do I do? Do I go for the Fury Slam? Actually, I can use a bit of mana here. Nice, nice. That's some good damage there. Is he going to split off again? He's not splitting this time. Ha! Let's do it. Now he's dead. He's totally going to die from that. That dude split off. Stop splitting. <laughs> Arrow Barrage again. Okay, that guarantees these guys dead. And that guarantees this guy dead. Easy. Okay, we got it. We got it. And did I need to heal before that fight? Maybe I could have gotten away with it. But we got ourselves another defensive fence, so we can heal in the next time we need to do something. Or do I go for the souls? I kind of need those souls. That's 49. I'm going to risk it. Okay, anything good here? Reduce damage taken when you have no armor. That happens a lot. Drain three to five extra armor in defending. That's kind of nice. 90% or more damage of a target's HP and killing it in one turn gets you one extra turn. You get rewarded for doing big damage. I like that. If you're killing little baby minions, that's huge. Don't you have an item that heals you when you gain armor? No, I've got an item that does damage when I gain armor. But this is only extra armor. No, no, I think Stolen Heart's really good. If I can snipe baby minions, I get one extra turn. I'll take it. That's a good powerhouse item. Okay, we heal up and we're good to go in the next round. How deep is the game so far? I mean, this is only the second area that we've unlocked. First area was tricky with that boss fight. But we're doing pretty good. What's this? Wishing Pond. Spend coins to increase your attributes. Hey, good thing I stocked up on some coins. Oh, I've maxed out the Companion Elf. Okay, so there's no way I can get that stronger. Starcatcher Bottle. Colossal Jizo. Can I upgrade this? No, I don't want to upgrade that. I'm going to go for a new piece. Altar of Speed, Altar of Magic, Campfire, and the Merchant. Okay, let's go with Mage Lady and go down here to this altar. I 
actually no. I want the elf. She's too good. These aren't good. I don't have enough for five relic fragments, which is what I would spend the money on. Max HP and max MP for 400 each is not worth it. That's not worth it. Battle zone range increased by one is kind of nice, because then you can attack, uh, get your whole party in within an extra radius on the outside. But I don't like these. No, that does not fit my playstyle. Is that a buzzing bee? That's eh, a wasp. Oh dear. Rain of arrows. Get in there. Armor break, arc split weakness. The grass hornet probably does poison damage. It's gonna be like. <gasps> he survives on two health! Oh, he dies! Seven damage is fine. Nice. Easy kills. Easy. Hey, Dennis, welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. Good to see you, man. Uh, Fruits of Life for heals, nice. 19 souls is not much. I think I go for the heal here. Ooh, some fights. Go take this fight. Silence upon death. I'm assuming that means I can't cast spells once he's dead. Oh, he almost died. Dang, it took six damage. Okay, silence means what? I don't know. It seems like we can't, can't cast spells. But that was too easy. Fruit of life, let's go. Okay, one hour passed, we're down to six hours. That's not too bad. I'm glad I have the spare defensive fence in case I need it. Altar of speed. I think the boss fight's gonna be in the bottom right. I don't think it's gonna be top right. Altar of magic. Let's get Lady up here to do this. I got her pretty low on the health to get plus two. That better have been worth it. Because then I can rest here. Oh, totally worth it. Totally worth it. Uh, I'm going to go exploring. What is that? Oh, that's the pitcher dude. It's going to be boss and shopping time. One, two, three, four, five. She can go shopping for us. So let's get you two in here. Alter of speed. Speed is always important. It's the two healing dudes. That's an easy fight. That does... They do no damage. They just heal each other when they die. Oh no, he's dead! Anyways... Oh no, I took three damage. Yeah, it's just, it's easy. Too easy. Let's go. Uh, I can go for souls or healing. Souls is better. Eleven is nice. Helps out with the shot. There's a wasp. Do I want to do the wasp fight? I don't want to do the pitcher fight. Oh, no. No, 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 no. I'm not fighting the pitchers separately. Ah, I screwed up. Dang it. I should have, I should have joined forces. I thought I was going to come around the other way. Ah, that was a mistake. Okay. Down to five hours is kind of bad. But we need to go down here. 
two versus three. The only risk is the Hornet. So do I go Reign of Arrows here? Yes. Because that guarantees a kill down here. Oh, I hate these dudes healing each other so much. Okay, he's guaranteed dead. Hornet's gonna hit, take zero damage. He dies, he heals him, he takes damage, deals five damage here, that's fine. Okay, I didn't get my turn back because I didn't do more than 90% of his, his health. That is unfortunate, but that makes sense. Tiga's got a new one. What she got? <laughs> I think you did spend too much time. I think you did spend too much time redrawing it. Very nice. That's um, that's the Mr. Beast 100 people, isn't it? The, the Squid Games Mr. Beast one. <laughs> I do have sort of the Mr. Beast eyes a little bit now with the with the editing. It's not too bad. I mean, the eye on this dude is definitely out of whack. And some of these faces definitely look a little bit off. But nice, nice. <laughs> oh man, I gotta get more poses for the Mr. Beast stuff. Uh, do I go charge shot here? No, let's just go for a normal attack. Because he's dead anyways. 95 souls, very good for shopping. Uh, do I go 19 or do I go for the heal? I think the heal's more important. Just because I'm going to try and plow through these fights. Let's go for this fight as well. It's two versus one. Easy fight. There's no healers this time. <laughs> as much as those healers are easy to deal with, they're kind of annoying. Oh, he survives with two health. Unfortunate. Uh, let's go healing again. The tanky boy needs some help. Oh, I found the boss. But I'm running out of time, chat. I am definitely running out of time. I don't think I can go for that altar. Poor Mosquito. Yeah, I know. He deserved it, though. Increased damage reduction when defending. Passive. Dragon scale. All your characters start guard at the start of battle. Restore 1 MP at the start of each turn. What? That's pretty sick. But I don't desperately need it because I already have insane amounts of mana. If I didn't have a mana situation, that would have solved it. I don't have enough for a class where I'm like, fudge, I'm so close. So close. You have a funny one though, I haven't finished it yet? Nice, can't wait, man. Lowest HP at the end of the battle, HP. Herbs is actually pretty good, but it's not on sale. I think I have to skip here, chat. Because as much as negate debuffs is good, it's 600 bucks. You know what? Maybe I should get it. Maybe maybe I just should get it. It's it's a free defense. It, it has, stops against poisons and stuff. I am casting tons of spells. We are the Shadow Money Wizard Gang. Just trying to cast every spell possible. You know what? Fine, I'll buy it. And then I have a little bit of money left over for the class thing that I can spell on. Next time I go shopping, I should have enough to get us something. And I could eventually sell this Fortify if I need to. I'm not defending on any of my bros yet, so I'm keeping this in the wing. Okay, fair enough. Okay, we got the guard. Now all we need is we need to go to the boss right now. Because I don't want to waste another hour wandering just for the speed. So, boss time. This should just be a mini boss. It's an ugly mini boss. Whoa, 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 calm down on the healing, buddy. 
double action, of course. Rain of Arrows here is very important, I think. Because they have a lot of shielding. Holy crap. Okay, there goes all the shielding. There goes the poisoning. Uh, Fury Slam is going to be good on the dude who's weakened, which is the back dude. Always remember who's got the vulnerable. That's very important. Here comes a hit. Status resistance. Oh, he resisted the guard. Oh, the guard helps with this. Armor reduction and poison. Okay, good. We fireball the back dude and he's going to die soon. Don't heal anybody. Okay, three damage across the board is not too bad. The guard stays even to the next turn. Ah, uh, my soldier's dying. I'm sorry, did I not did I not give him two extra defense? He needs to defend now. That is very much the case. Okay, now she's dying. Oh my lord, it's not good to not have a healer chat. Uh-oh. Well, the two little dudes are dead. Let's hope the tree doesn't hurt. He went for a heal. Okay, that's good. That's good. Don't hurt me. Oh, Cha, I'm barely surviving. But we win. We freaking win. <laughs> that, that was a little bit that was a little bit scary just just a teeny weeny bit magical sharing that's the one for the MP I think fruit of life I don't need souls I do need and defensive fences I think I'm fine let's go for the souls I need to go shopping crystal dagger when more than 50 still damage to gain one BP I don't think I can crit for 50s Seraphic Watch? Yes! That is huge! A free power every turn? 100%. Hopefully it goes to the, the Archer every single time, because she benefits the most from power. You have a strong mental image when snow is clenching hard? Yes, plenty of clenchings. Gate of Challengers sends treasure nearby, that'll be nice. Location of the boss, that's fine. Four hours remaining, movement points, and an extra hour in the dungeon's not doing too bad. Uh, da, 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 da. There's the challenge, there's some really strong fights. We are not completely full health. That's a slight issue. There's the merchant. I do need to go and say hi to him. I have 50 points. I'm going to be buying something new at the merchant this round. So, I think we ignore this spot, and we go up. No, 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 I don't need to heal. I don't think I want to fight the reds, but I think the reds do give me relics. Uh, I think they did last time. Uh, okay, this isn't too bad if I... Oh, wait, I remember these stupid dudes hurt if I don't kill them immediately. No, the vulnerable went on the wrong person. There's a vulnerable on this dude. Okay, wait, wait. Maybe we survive. Okay, that's a bit bad for health. He's gone and hardened. It's a darn metapod right there. Okay, now we just need another rain of arrows and we win. Arrow barrage. This should kill them. Yes! Wait, how did he survive? Oh, that hurts. Oh, 
Okay, that's a good kill before the poison procs. That was a smart move. Okay, I think I need the... F as much as I want soul, I need fruit of life. I'm going to be fighting these, these mini bosses. Kind of important to not die whilst I'm doing it. Okay, that's fine. Tiga, how's it going for the memes? <laughs> that actually looks pretty good. That one looks good. I like it. It's the Mr. Beast. I just, my hair is all wrong. That's the only thing. If it's not the hair, I could work it. If I got the same hairstyle, that's the only thing. Because my hair flops a bit too much. His goes over a lot more easily. But I don't do anything fancy to my hair. It's not that much importance to me. Uh, okay, lady face. We go down and around here, right? I'm running out of hours. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I just realized something, chat. The more time I spend on these turns is pretty bad. <laughs> Ooh, we gotta be careful. We gotta be really careful. Rain of Arrows. Let's get rid of the Silence Dude on death. Fury Slam into the Weakened One. That didn't kill him. Don't hurt me! Okay, front guy's fine. Don't hurt my mage. Okay, good. Phew. That could have gone bad. Arrow Barrage is just so good with this build. So good. Let's go for some healing. Yeah, I gotta rush the boss. I've got three hours left. You guys can't see it because my face is in the way constantly. But I do not have much time for this round. Oh, but this is the boss boss. This is the last zone. Okay, no, no, I have time. Okay, let's not panic too much. I also have the spare hour from defensive fences. We can make this work. I also need to go shopping desperately. Oh, that's a lot of enemies. Luckily, I do AoE damage, except for the healer dude. That's the only annoyance here. AoE's nice. There's the poison who procs first. Little wolfy dude's not dead yet. He's not dead yet. I'm taking damage. It's a lot of damage. Why am I so slow? Okay, that kind of worked. Don't like that. Don't like it. Don't like it at all. Okay, fireball on that dude's fine. And then all I need to do is insane rain of arrows and then they're all dead. Almost all dead. There we go. Mm-hmm. That's a heal. Okay, I kind of have an issue. I think I know I can solve my issue. So it sounds finished for me, Matila Harvest. It does. It definitely does. And you've got plenty of time to do it in Tiga. You've got all the time in the world. Um, I think what I need to do is wait, one, two, three, four, five. Which that doesn't work. Do I need to do it next turn? Yes, no. One, two, three, and then I need to go shopping. I need to heal, and then 
I need to go northeast, so what's the right play? Do I use up my plus two movement to heal here, but then I run out of space and I've lost my movement? I found the boss. Oh, okay, that was the smart choice. Okay, we found the boss. We don't need to go northeast. Uh, I need to go north for the shop. I need to go for this fight. This fight gives me a relic. This gives me the heal. Okay, I'm not in a, I'm not in a gigantic rush anymore. Because I found the boss. I was worried I didn't know where the boss was. Yeah. Now the base cam will get the hockey RL stream soon? Possibly. That could be a possibility, Barlow. Uh, da -da 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 -da, only two hours left. Uh, move as a team. One, two. Treasure chest! Yes! Let's go! Let's freaking go! And it came with a relic. <laughs> After using four skills, your next single hit deals 50% extra damage. That's insane. Mirage armors, every third armor gain is doubled. That's no, that's not good. No. And the one BP at the start of the battle. That is reliable. The energy collector is not as reliable. Because then I might do an AoE skill. But it says your next single hit, so it actually is very reliable. No, 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 no. Energy collector is the right play. Definitely the right play. Yeah. No, 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 don't. You made him panic. <laughs> good one on the panic, man. Okay, let's go shopping. A thousand exact points to go shopping with, chat. Please be good, please be good, please be good. That's kind of tricky. I'm never going to have my bros at full HP. No, I don't like that. Though I am dealing... I am... Re I'm healing one MP every turn. So what's that? Two or three damage to every enemy every single turn? Is that... Is that worth a thousand bucks? I don't think it's worth a thousand bucks. It's, I mean, it's its two damage per turn to every enemy. It's actually six damage per turn because there's three guys on my team. Maybe it's worth it. Samurai gets extra armor to defending 50% chance to apply vulnerable and mage deals damage to an enemy. That's actually kind of nice now. Maybe I'd do it. I think maybe Lunar Harvest is just better than nothing. I mean, we're at the stage where we're going to fight a boss. We need something. And if I refresh for 200, there's no way I can buy something else. Everything's so expensive right now. So I think I have to, against a boss, go with Sanguine Scripture. Excuse me. Because the Flag of Mandate... I'm not built very well against defense. Um, normal attacks with crit and healing... That sounds good, but I'm going with AoE, and I'm going with Poison build, so I like... My crits don't do very much. So I think I've got to go Lunar Harp... ...and Sanguine... ...and then I could always sell my Magical Sharing. A, A, but this does damage! So why don't I embed it? My my tank does not have an AoE. Now this is nine damage to every enemy. Oh, it's more than nine damage. Cause it, it, oh, this is amazing. Chat, that relic just made this thing overpowered. Three MP to all teammates, including yourself. So what does that mean? That's nine times two is 18 damage to every enemy. If that's how it calculates it. Excluding yourself. Okay, so then, sorry, I read that wrong. That's six times two is 12. So 12 damage to every enemy. Increase the damage when we're defending. I may as well put it on. I. Am I going to defend ever? Mm. It's either that or dying, chat. Do I risk it? I could... Uh, I, I'll i take it, I'll take it. I'll take it. It's, it's, it's a boss fight, I gotta be careful. 
Okay, so now that I'm feeling strong, let's go and heal. Hmm. One hour has passed. I've got one hour left to win the game, chat. I think I can do this. Because I can also gain the extra hour from defense offense if I need to. Yep. Now, this is not the boss fight. This is the mini boss fight. We can do a mini, mini boss fight prediction. Because I don't know how this is going to go. So, here's a prediction from the mini boss. I need this mini boss. Oh, it's actually not that bad. Unless that paralyzing mushroom does something fancy. There is a chance it does something scary. But it's nice and slow on the movement. So I'm thinking we'll be fine. I'm worried about the big boss fight, though. That's the thing. I don't know what's in store for that. Could be anything. Also, how many points does it cost to upgrade Sanguine? Oh, it's actually pretty cheap. I might upgrade it. Not that expensive. You guys thinking this is a win? Yeah, I'm thinking you guys are right. This guy might duplicate, but it, I'm not sure what he does. Maybe he stuns us. Okay, thanks for the six damage, buddy. What happens if I do magical sharing here? It does work. Even if I'm full mana, it works, chat. That's amazing. I was worried it wouldn't work at full mana. I'm very impressed that that mechanic works. What did he just do? I don't know what he just did. I don't like what he just did. But they're all dead. Critical hit 100 times. That's a good achievement. Thank you very much. Uh, I think I go for the heals because we're going into a fight that I need to make sure I'm at maximum capacity. And... That's not that great. Extra vulnerable stacks equals 20% extra damage. That's kind of nice. But that's to last a long time for that to happen. I mean, Flame Arrow's good, but I don't stack many burns. But it is damage. It's better than Energy Talisman, because Energy Talisman takes so long. That takes 10 turns. Or a little bit more because... Oh, no, a little bit less because of my new thingy. Zoro, shush! He's in his whiny phase. Um, Normal attacks to the burn. One second shot. That cat does have moments. He certainly does. Uh, he... Oh, he does like complaining. Uh, whenever we leave the house, he gets super, like, lonely. He's super socially, super attached. And so, whenever something doesn't go his way or, like, he feels alone, he's got a meow. You can see me moving back green screen. Yeah, the green screen does move a bit. It's actually, because it's getting darker at night, it actually reflects too much of the light... It's kind of annoying. I'm sure if I turned off... No, would, I, would it work if I turned off the main light? 
Maybe I just need more light. I think that's the issue. Eh. Yeah, it'll it'll survive for the moment. I think it just needs more light. Most most movie sort of situations that means more light to reflect it. If I turned off the light, it'd probably be worse. Okay, so um, decisions. Energy talisman takes too long to activate and be useful. I think twenty percent's not much. I think I go flame arrow. Flame arrow at least hurts early. Yeah, we go flame arrow. Uh, and I still have movement to go down to the main boss. Let's go! Okay, we got this, chat. We got this. Uh, the prediction from last time. Congratulations to all the believers. That wasn't too bad of a fight. Uh, but now, now, here's the real prediction. Uh, Afroni, thank you very much for the follow. Much appreciated. Welcome to the stream. And welcome to the boss fight. We've never seen this boss. I've got no idea what he does, but I'm going to be very scared regardless. Uh, because I've been scared of every other boss that we've had to fight previously. I love our build. I think our build is great. I just don't... know. Oh, before we jump in, though. Wait a minute. Before we jump in... Are you kidding me? It ended her turn? I can't jump in again? Oh, fine, I'll have to waste my emergency rations. Before we jumped in, I wanted to upgrade Sanguine Scripture. Yeah, I wanted to upgrade that because I had the points. That's so stupid, I have to waste the emergency ration for this. Just so I can click on the boss room. That, I don't like that mechanic. That's really annoying. Okay, anyways, let's jump in anyways. Let's, let's see how we go. Chat might be thinking that I'm going to lose this. What the hell is that? Entangle. Deal 3 damage and lose 1 H MP per turn. Turns remaining 99,999. On my mage! Oh, at least she has the most magic out of everybody, though. We're on a clock. We're on a clock, chat. Now, here's the problem. I don't want to do Reign of Arrows, do I? Wait, 3 times 3 is 3 times 4, so 12. 17's better. God, this is going to be painful. This is the plan I didn't take care of, so it's taking care of its owner. Yeah, I think you're right. Here it goes again. What are you doing? Normal attack, 9 damage. That's not bad. That's not bad. I can deal with that. Magical sharing's pretty good. Except Selfless Charge does more to a single target. Uh-oh, I already uh, I activated its phase two already. Okay, we're doing good. I did not trigger my vulnerable. That's not good. Don't you dare summon mobs, because I can deal with them. I oh, got another entangle. Great. Charge shot deadly precision. Come on, hit him. He's below 50%. Let's go. That means we're going to proc Thorn Torture Whip every time. He's pissed. We got him down to 88 health because we're doing insane damage. Chat, we're too freaking good. We're too good. This team. This team is too good. It's over. Ha 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 ha. This is just a single big fat dude that dies to dots. I can't believe the first boss was the hardest boss we had to deal with. And this team is so strong. I was panicking, hey. For good reasons. Mortify, what do we get? Do I want to go for souls 124 or defensive fence? Because of the trickiness of the game, I might go defensive fence because I've been a bit scared recently. So we'll go with second fence. Archer gains one extra normal attack. No! Flintstone! It's the Flintstones. Uh, magic fireballs. Additional stack of burn. Is the music louder? It's only because it's boss music. That's why. It might just be you, though. But the boss music goes hard. Time reward. Obtain Relic Fragment 1. Nice. All skills unlocked. 
CR crit increased by two for all members. Very nice. Altar of Speed. Don't really need it. Whoa, this place is huge. But there's only two rounds. Okay. There's a wishing pool that I don't... Oh, hi, Mao. Hi, do you want some pats? Okay, you come back for pats. Easy game. I mean, we are just dumpstering with this team build. So congratulations to all the believers, chat. Well done. Did you just read the prediction? Yep, just did it. Meow, meow indeed. Yeah, hello. Hello, we won the boss fight. I did not expect to win that easily. Uh, where do you guys think the boss is? I think it's in the top. It's looking very empty up here. Oh, the merchant's really close. When will the cone be removed? Uh, hopefully this week. Hopefully this week. Because uh, she needs to go see the dock first to get the staples out. She would be fine if she didn't, like, try and nibble at her stitches and staples and stuff, and then she wouldn't have to wear the cone. But she doesn't mind it. She's perfectly fine with it on. She doesn't... It just slightly gets in the way of her cleaning, eating, all sorts of stuff like that. But she's not, like, super pissed at it, because she's learned to live with it quite easily. So, nothing to worry about that. Do I go for the Altar of Speed? I think I do. I need the Mage to be faster. I'm going to be honest. She needs to be faster. There we go, plus two speed, very good. What is that? That looks like a skeleton in a shade? No, that's not a shade, that's a dead eye. It's a reaper in a dead eye. Whoa, they have a lot of health. These are the basic enemies? Chat, may I remind you, that boss we just beat had 300 health. Okay. Death mark. Instantly kills the target when the timer expires. Cool story, bro. Cool story, bro. Okay, dude bro's gonna die. Now dude bro has to die, or we're screwed. Come on, boy, come on. Don't you hurt me. If you want to march somebody else, that's fine, but don't do damage. Oh, he did damage. Uh, do I go for a magic attack or just normal? Normal attack's fine. Okay, we're fine, we're fine. We took a little bit of damage, but it's okay. 82's fine. Let's go for the heal. Yes, please. Now, I don't want to go shopping just yet. I kind of want to do some fighting first. Because I know I can skip to the everything else. No, 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 I don't want to heal either. Do I go for the event? No, I kind of need to figure out where we're going. Yeah, we'll go south. I, I kind of think north is the right answer. But I'm not sure. Evil fairies. Okay, this is a hard fight. Okay. Rain of Arrows, you'll survive me. Nice free damage, nice free poison. Fire Lady's getting faster. Let's go. Let's go. Who do we want to kill? Uh, the eyeball is pretty slow. The fairies are pretty fast. I need to kind of kill one of these, I think, because they're going to do damage. Yep, they're regenning. Yep, they're regenning. No! They just regen at the start of their turn? Are you kidding me? What? 
What? They all just like healed a max health on the start of their turn. What? That's a thing? Oh, it's three cost for the barrage. That kind of sucks. Look like they're already dead? Yeah, they kind of do look like they're already dead. They kind of don't at the same time. Okay, you're dead, you're dead, you're dead. I'm silenced, but that doesn't help. Are you going to regen? Dang it, stop regening. And I need to stop getting poisoned. Okay, good kill, good kill. These undead are really prolonging the fights, and I don't like it. Uh, Fruit of Life, yes please. Is that right, Meow Meow? Yeah, you're getting some good cuddles. Uh, a normal fight... Battle zone increased by one. Five relic fragments is very tempting. But my money's doing well enough that I could buy just another relic. No, I'm not going to spend any money here. Down to seven hours. It's not a good sign. Please tell me the boss is here. <laughs> yes! No, I'm one tile away. Fudge. Dang it. Let's go into a normal fight. Okay, I'll do it next time. The phone battery's gonna die, so have a good one, Tiga. Thanks, man. You have a good one. Look after yourself. Uh, do I go for this hit? No, let's go for the AoE. AoE's better. AoE's always the right choice, because I just get extra bonus hits from everything that I do. Uh, magical sharing's probably good here. I'm going to be honest. Oh, but I don't have two allies. I only have one ally. Okay. Magical sharing, not too amazing. Whoa, that hurt. Calm down, boys. Yikes. There we go. Fury Slam just to make sure he doesn't survive the blow. He dies to poison. Perfect. Can't charge while watching the stream? Oh, that's not a good thing. Well, I do hope you're able to come back eventually. Take care. Make sure the phone doesn't die. It'll be a sad time for the phone. Okay, this will be the last round before we go into the boss fight. Because I need to make sure we go shopping. Shopping time! I'm glad I went south. I kind of thought it was north, but I thought it was south. Whoa, we are not rich enough. Why does everything keep getting so expensive? Deal 10% extra damage to bosses and leaders. Restore two mana points every turn in boss battles. Of course, like, why not? 10% extra damage to boss and leader. Like, how is that not a good thing? I can sell one of these. I can sell the Fortify. I have to buy this. Do you keep all your gear when you die? Um, No, it's kind of like Slay the Spire where you just restart the run and you don't keep all the good stuff. It's a roguelite. Uh, restore 3 HP when a debuff supplied to you. That's not as good. Yeah, I'm going Meteorite Compass, 100%. Even though I have already... Ma all my mana issues are sorted. I just have infinite mana now. It's not what I was looking forward to, but it's fine. Embed. There's nothing to embed. We're good. We're out. Now, one thing I need to do before we do the boss fight is... Lady face, go get yourself healed. Because you can. 
And then I can buff Sanguine Scripture to be always do vulnerable when you do damage. And I guess that's all I've got. Also, I can probably upgrade the fire. No, I can't. Would have been nice if I upgraded that one too. Okay, boss time! Now this is kind of a mini boss, this isn't the boss boss. So I think we're gonna be okay. Ooh, he's a bit scary though. 13 damage. Ooh, boy. That's something. You know what? Just because it's getting to that scary part of the game, I might do a prediction just in case. Just in case, chat. Please do enjoy the prediction. I'm not sure how it's going to go. Will the stream be up a bit longer? Yeah, yeah. It's only 7.45. It's not that late. Get a stream till I have to go to bed. That's how we'll do it. And also, the kitty cat had to go. But she just decided to head off. She likes hanging around for a bit, then leaving, then hanging around for a bit, then leaving. Okay, enjoy the gambit, chat. Didn't realize the cat was there the whole time. <laughs> she wasn't there the whole time, but she does jump up and down every now and again. But because she has the cone, she can't jump up, so she needs me to get her to jump up. So I grab her and put her up on top of me. Yeah. Whereas Zoro himself, he knows how to jump without the help, because he doesn't have a cone on. Yeah. Okay. Gamba's almost ready. And I think I hear the sound of dinner. Yeah, yeah, I'll do it. Thank you, dear. Is that all? Oh, you got two of them. Why is there two? You got me a treat on top of it. Okay, I think my wife is spoiling me too much, chat. Holy crap. How am I able to finish all this? Some of it's yours? Oh, oh, because you want me to show them your thing that you ordered as well. Okay, chat. So... This is a, um, a famous place on the coast, on the Brizzy Coast area. And uh, we have a very fancy Australian meal today. It's going to be lovely dinner time. Yep, we have ourselves. Uh, let's, let's open it up for chat. There we go. It is pies, meat pies. There we go, look at that. Australian classic. Very fancy. Very gourmet. Look at that. It's beautiful, it's actually really nice. I don't know which one's which though, dude. Does it have it on the top? It does, this one's mushroom. Is that one mine? Yeah? Open your one as well, what did you get? What's the filling? So my one's got mushroom. Oh wow, this one's heavy. Oh, hi, Mao. Sorry, I can't give this one to you, Mao. This one is peas, potato, gravy, bacon, and cheese. Holy, what the hell? This is why I didn't ask you to put that on mine. What the freaking hell did you get, dear? It's literally embedded inside of it. It's a monster! Chat, it's a, it's a literal monster. There's, there's peas, potato, and gravy all inside. The, they, they, like, they, like, pumped into the thing. Into the pie. Extra stuff. Yeah, that's, that's literally a monster and a half. Okay, so you enjoy that one, dear. There you go. Uh, we got gravy as well for something. Did they have chips or something? The gravy is yours? Oh, okay. The gra You're adding gravy into that pie. As, as if she needs more on top of it. There's the napkins. What's this? Vanilla. And then there's apple and cream. Oh! This is the dessert? Oh, they do dessert pies as well. Okay, okay. Whoa! Is that the apple custard thingy? No, what is this? Apple and cream. So it's an apple pie. Ooh! That looks good, doesn't it, chat? Look at that. Apple and cream. To rip off and dry my mushrooms. Yeah, I'm going mushrooms, 100%. I, I'm not having anything of hers. She gets all the weird stuff, uh, uh, way overloaded stuff. I get apple and cream and mushroom pie. And then what's the one that she got for dessert? 
Oh, we got a vanilla slice. That's a vanilla slice? Mm -hmm. Oh, I love vanilla slices. This one's for me, too. But it's pink. Why is it pink? Anyways, the vanilla slice is a classic Australian dessert. It is vanilla custard between two pastry pieces. And um, if you can see if I can angle this correctly. Uh, it's got... This one's got icing on top? That's kind of weird. But it's usually got, like, uh, powdered sugar and sometimes some cream and stuff on top. But it's just a really nice dessert. It's really nice. But let me let me just try that. Yeah, I think that is icing. It doesn't need icing, though. Fine, I'm not going to eat it. Fine, 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 fine. You can have it. It's yours. I'm still okay with the apple. Apple's nice. Okay. Love you, dear. Thank you for the lovely dinner. Okay. So yeah, definitely going to be happy with my lovely, lovely piece. And I, Asha. Oh, look who, look who shows up. Did you smell dinner? Yes, yes. She's definitely going to try and steal some of that. I'm not sure if she'll eat it, though. I mean, she won't eat the mushroom, but she'll eat the, um... She'll eat the other bits. Did you know Snow White the herbal video I shared you? Herbal soup. I might have shown it to her, I can't remember. Never gonna have too much gravy? Yeah, but usually. Usually you can't have too much gravy. Gravy's great. How warm is this? It's pretty warm. It's still fine. Bit pastry on the outside, so I gotta get to the inside of it. Oh, it's got nice... It's like an actual good big mushroom pieces in it, chat. There you go. It's got actually big pieces of mushroom. It's very nice. And then you just gotta, like, scoop out some of the middle filling. I know, it smells good, doesn't it? <laughs> you didn't care much for the subway. The salami's a bit spicy for you, but you did like the ham, but oh, you really want this, don't you? Yeah, she does, and she's she's jumping up to want some. No, it's gonna be really hard to feed you, Mal. Enjoy your dinner, Stefan. Thank you, dear, for delivering. Much appreciated, sweetie. But yeah, meat pies are such a big thing in Australia. Everybody eats meat pies. This is just a gourmet, so this is not like your average meat pie you get from the store. Not the average one you can make at home in terms of like heating it up for dinner. These ones are fancier. Oh, but they're nice. Good to treat yourself once in a while to them though. Mm. Very nice. But it's completely savory. It also has a drive through Yeah, that's the other good part. Evil streamer sees it's got more at 11. Mm-hmm. Fine, she can have some chat. Oh, it's a bit warm, though, man. Here, can you have this? Are you okay with that? Here, here, try it. Mel? There you go. There we go. She had a piece of chat. Was it good? Yeah, was it good? Yeah? No? Was it not what you expected? Do you want more? Of course she wants more. Oh, look what she done, chat. She definitely wants some more. Can I get another little piece? There we go. No. Yeah. Come on. There you go. Happy cat. You got Zoro begging for some of yours? Yeah, of course Zoro would go and beg. The cats know when the perfect time is to strike chop. It's not too strong on the flavor, 
Like sometimes you get like a beef or steak or something. I think this is actually pork. I'm not sure what meat this is, but I think it's pork. It's not a strong flavor, which is nice. They don't have like a super strong gravy. But some ones you can get are, it's steak, it is. It's not a very strong steak flavor. But it's nice, it's not like dry steak, it's juicy steak. Which is why I thought it was pork, because steak can sometimes be pretty dry. But it is messy. Gotta work on that. Caught that one in the box. Mm. Yeah, I don't know how Snow Wife is dealing with her meal. Steak and mushroom, perfect timing, perfect, perfect amount, not too overloaded. Peas and mushrooms and peas and mashed potatoes and everything. If they did a side of chips, that would be a nice addition to this. Morning, Kate. Good to see you, man. It is definite dinner time. I think I'm running out of pastry on the edges. <laughs> There's a decent amount of filling, it's nice. 15 hours to 44 hours. Yeah, it definitely upped itself, Cake. Definitely. All thanks to Murph and Wingate and... Even Drazes too got some nice subs in there, too. Very, very thankful. But, at the same time, we got a lot of, lot of streaming to do. It was up to 49 earlier? Yeah, it's gone down a little bit, though. It's good. It's good. It's giving me hope. <laughs> No, 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 we're talking about the generosity and how the time went up so quickly. Just naming naming the fancy names that got us there. What are we eating? Uh, Australian meat pie. Tis a gourmet meat pie. This is not the normal ones you usually get. This one is steak and mushroom. Uh, the ones you buy at the shop are usually smaller and just more like factory made and stuff. Um, but these ones are, this is a nice company that makes it. And uh, gourmet, they've got a drive through and stuff, so we don't go there very often. It's more like a treat yourself sort of thing. No spiders? No. No spider typed meat pies, surprisingly. So, 100 left that you're spending, Wingate? Damn. Gonna have to worry about the time added there. <laughs> Thanks, man. That's good stuff. Waiting for another raid? No, waiting for another hype train, I think. Oh yeah, the raids as well. Since we're up a lot, we might get more raids as possible. Oh, that's so nice. If you guys get meat pies wherever you guys are, it's always a good thing to try. Sometimes you get good ones, sometimes you get bad ones, but the homemade ones or like the, um, the fancier meat pies are usually the ones that are the best. The super cheap ones are just, I don't know, sometimes the quality of it just really turns you off of it. Or sometimes when you're super hungry, it just doesn't matter. It just depends. Australians call them party pies. The super cheap ones that you get 
because the people who bring them to parties a lot, like kids' parties or even a lot of adult parties too. And everybody likes them. They're good enough. We're like a party snack. But that, that's what's good. Very nice. Don't know how much you can watch tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow's got some special stuff happening. I would recommend tuning in if you can. If you can. If not, you can always check up on the VODs. Party Pies, the little ones, pretty tasty. Yeah, the little ones. Yeah, the, the little ones are Party Pies. And they are pretty tasty. But once you've had like a fancier meat pie and you go back to Party Pies, you're like, oh, I see the difference. <laughs> and it's kind of hard to go back. But like when you're feeling hungry and you're at a party or something, it's Party Pies are just fine. Okay, I finally got through the Sprite. Oh, excuse me. They can be thermonuclear temperature-wise, or they can be frozen. They can be frozen in the middle sometimes, Saxon. It could be either or. You never know with party pies. They could be either really, really hot or really, really cold. You just have to get lucky. When are we repaying the submarine, says Cake? Hey, hey, hey. We already can get the submarine repaid. The team was already building another one. So we can go do that. And we can also do uh, battleship stuff as well. That'll be really fun. <laughs> okay, so dessert time, eh? I don't know how I'm going to finish this. But it looks so fancy, I have to eat it. It just looks good, chat. It's got so much cream. I think that's the thing that's winning me over. Is it's got a lot of cream. It's got a cute little hat. Oh, and the hat has some apple in it. <laughs> That's nice. Burnt on the outside, frozen in the middle. Yeah, you can do that with party pies. Depending on how you cook them. Okay, how am I going to eat this? It's a bit too tall. I think I have to squish it. Wish I had like a fork and a knife. That would be so much easier. But this is the, funner, this is the more fun way of doing it. Mmm. That's a lot of apple. But it needs to look green. Mmm. It needs more cream, technically, but it's really good. Mmm. Sorry, Mal. I ran out of the, the meat. I already gave you some. She will... Oh, actually, maybe she might like the cream. You want some cream? Yeah? It's not meat. <laughs> she likes milk and creamy things. Yeah, and you like the cream? Is it good? Did you want some more? No? Okay. It might be a little too sugary for her. You're hungry now? Yeah. Unfortunately, the snowman knows how to make people hungry by talking about and eating food on stream. It's a new low that I've stooped to. Making you all very hungry. But yeah, it's a cold apple pie, though. I forgot to mention. This is completely 100% cold. The meat pie was very nice and warm. I'm pretty sure there are places where you can get a warm apple pie with things, but this place does cold ones. Oh no, it's falling apart. <laughs> I, I'm losing integrity here, it's gone. What happens when you get too big with a piece of pie? Oh no, everything is going everywhere. 
<laughs> it's the end. I think I have to just like do, do bits and pieces on this thing now. But yeah, the cream is a little bit sugary though. So this is a little bit of sugar for me. Not sure if I can finish it completely though. I think I'll do that much for now. If I'm feeling hungry later, I might try and finish it. But I don't want to go too crazy. I really wasn't expecting a dessert. I only asked for the pie. Like, the actual pie. <laughs> the meat pie. So thank you, dear. But, oh, that's a bit, that's a bit filling. Block the entire goal of playing hockey? Yeah, exactly. Exactly. The more I fatten up chat, the more that I can stop those hockey pucks, and then I don't have to do anything else. It's great. When the fridge the cream will go off? Yeah, yeah, it will have to go in the fridge. Oh, that tastes funny. Having tea right after having apple pie is a weird combination. It's not bad, but it's a weird combination. Because my tongue's trying to feel tasty sweet stuff, and then the tea hits it. Excuse me. Yeah, it's still good. It just tastes weird. <laughs> Sorry, the caps? Yeah, don't worry about it, Seb. Don't worry about it, man. Alright. But yeah, um, sweetie. I might need to do a fridge run. <laughs> Most importantly, though, chat. We have a rain of arrows to start the fight. Okay, we're back into it. Back into it. And getting the mutant zombie out of the way is going to be important. I think his friends are more important, because what is this? That's man exhaustion. None of these have heals. I can't read what that guy has. I think he's got double action. Yeah, that's annoying. Okay, 9 and 8 is good damage. Now, fireball. Uh, I could kill this person. Yeah, let's go kill this one. What's he doing? 14 damage. I can live with that. Oh, magical sherry. Yes, the double 8 against everybody. Beautiful. Huge! This team builds on multi-hits, and that beats Undead, although I do worry about dying here. Why did I call it? My other bros are, like, practically full health. Okay. Okay, come on. Come on, buddy. That 14 hurts. Come on. Yes, die! Come on, come on, come on. We're so close to dying. Die, buddy. Die, please. That was a little too close. That was a little too close. Sheesh. What's the snow reveal? What snow reveal? Disappointing, isn't it? <laughs> exactly. Oh, that was scary. I need to go for the ominous compass here. Attack with higher armor. Three to five armor defending. Reduce damage when you have six more armor. Ah, oh, all these are dealing with armor. Uh, I think I go Warden's Ward. That's the smart play here. Because then I can kind of tell enemies where to attack. I have to do it. Find a game tactics, Ogre Reborn. You're addicted. I have that on my wish list for a good reason, Yeehaw. Definitely want to get into that game eventually. Just have to find time for it, but it's a good one. Glad you're enjoying it. And it's a 50-50 split practically shot. Congratulations on the Believers, because we won. 
Now the only problem is, how do we continue? We have, oh, she's not dead. Ha <laughs> ha, she got revived. I don't have to waste a revive. That's actually huge. But I only have five hours to finish the last room. And I really want to go Gate of Challengers because I need that extra relic. 66 hours and counting? Nice, nice. Mm-hmm. Okay, the, there's no way I have money for a merchant. There's no way I'll have money. What is that? That's a crab? It's an undead crab. Okay, the boss is either on the bottom right or the bottom left. And in five hours, I can get there. Okay, so let's go together. The difficulty two, that means this can't be too bad. It's 40 hour time, we're on a subathon. Subathon, which means the stream ends in 44 hours. But I add an extra eight hours because of the sleeping thing. You know, sleep is important. Okay, he's got the weaken, which is really good. We fireball to try and make sure he's weakened again. Yes, there's more weakening. And then we go for the sudden slash or the magical sharing. No, fury slam is more important. Because then I have more armor and he attacks me. Oh, that was annoying AoE. Oh, this dude hurts. Okay, he's dead. Good. Only eight hours sleep and 44 eight. No, 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 no. Eight hours every every day, not just just in the 44 hours. No, 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 no. Don't panic too much, my man. I gotta wash my hands. My hands are a bit dirty. Um, soul 15. Extra healing. Healing is important here. Yeah, madman. No, I'm not completely a madman. Philip, welcome to the stream, man. I'll be one second shot. I gotta go put this in the fridge and I gotta go quickly wash my hands because the pies do make a mess. The napkins did well, but they didn't survive completely. So I'll be right back in just a second. There we go. Forgot I didn't go to the bathroom all day as well. That's kind of slightly important to do as well. Oh, good stuff, chat. Good stuff. Nice, clean hands. 
Very good. Okay, let's go. Snowball mining begin. Exactly, exactly. I'm going to be exhausted. No, I'll be fine. I'll be fine. You don't have to worry about me, chat. We are doing well. Uh, do we want to move as a group? Yes, because I want to go down to these bottom fights and see if I can manage this. Ew, do I want to fight this? Yeah, I can fight this. Then again, I'm trying to minimize damage taken, but if I fight these fights easily, I could get health back. Maybe. Rain of Arrows, very good. Good start. These guys heal a lot, which is annoying. Uh, it's Fireball, one to kill them. Yes! Dies before she can heal. Fury Shield. Guarantees the kill... No! Takes six damage, it's kind of annoying, but we can heal that. We can heal that. Nice. I don't have to care about mana. Mana's just an... It's an afterthought in this team. And now I can do Fruit of Life to heal everybody back up. Perfect. And what is this? Altar of Magic. No, I don't want you to do the magic. I want Ladyface to do the magic. Nice. Nice. Mage plus two. Gorgeous stuff. Let's go. So we're down to four hours to go. Ladyface? Yeah, Ladyface is the best. Uh, I still think left is the right direction, but I'm going to go right to try and get these things first. Excuse me. Don't know what that dude is, but he looks a little scary. Oh, he does look... He's a corpse surgeon. He's got a giant vial of blood on his back. With 150 health. Oh, dearie me. That's not a good thing. Uh, do they have the targeting thing? Yes, I do have Warden's Ward. I think I'm going to go with the Fury Soul, but if I go Magical Sharing, that's going to hit them really hard. But I kind of want to defend here. So we go for the middle one, and then that gives me seven armor. Fireball for Middle Lady, so she dies. Ten damn it! What do you mean you're attacking that person? Why? Why? I have the armor up. You're meant to be attacking my armor person. What is this? I have the armor. I don't understand. Blood potion, not a health potion? It could be. You never know. Um, I don't know who to kill. I gotta go for big dude. I need to make sure she dies, 100%. Come on, attack my tank, you stupid dude! Yes! Thank you! How hard was that to do, buddy? How hard was it to do? You have the armor, not the plot armor. Yeah, exactly, I've got normal armor, which isn't helping me. Okay, fireball kill, very nice. That took more damage than I was wanting to. So please heal up the team a little bit. Not really good. Okay, I'm going to try to minimize the normal battles we take, because the normal battles seem to be a problem. Do I go for the mini-boss right now? Three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. One, two, three. I don't really don't have much movement. No, it's not heal here. There's an enemy we have to fight down here. And if I want to go shopping, there's an enemy we have to fight up here. Uh, I am actually getting a lot of money. I might need to go shopping. 
have to go as a team or I'm screwed. Oh, this dude's a little scary, but he's by himself, so maybe he's not... Two times ten! Ooh, whoa, 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 and he's got two phases. He used Indomitable chat. He's not allowed to do that. No, 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 that's my thing. No, 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 Indomitable's my thing, game. You can't take that from me. Snow, I have something of great importance that I, Snowbot, must now let you know. Really? Snowbot, what is it? Shh, that's a lot of health. Son of a biscuit, but I'm all out of biscuit. I'm all out of biscuit. This dude's screwing me completely. Okay, now he's at half stage. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does it mean? Is he going to kill me? Oh boy, we're doing really badly. I need to go heal. I need to go heal. I need to go heal. But the fireball's stacking, which is huge. Flurry slam to 12 times two. Come on, we need to outspeed him, we need to outspeed him, we need to outspeed him. No, 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 he goes first! No! He was on three health, he could have killed me. Oh my lord. I almost got rid of him before he could have done something. Yeah, thank goodness that wasn't too bad. Okay, I'm gonna go souls. <laughs> and I'm gonna go heal. 100%. Literally never seen me use it, the biscuits? Nah, I, I don't. Biscuits are fine. Retain arc equal to defense. Ooh. Third armor, reduced damage. I think Runecraft is the right play here. I've got no refreshes. Uh, third armor game's bad. Reduced damage by two. No, 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 no. Runecraft is good. That keeps giving free armor. Oh, we fully healed anyways. Okay, we don't need to heal. Oh, I was worried about that. Okay, could have been worse. Could have been worse. Okay, the boss fight's not there. We figured it out. We're down to three hours. Can I do this? Is there something that teleports me to the other side of the map? No. I'm gonna do this fight in case the boss is over here. I don't think it will be. I just don't want to take free damage, but I know there's a healing thing up ahead, so I'll take that as well in case I'm desperate. Okay, good AoE damage. I don't like the Reaper, but at least he does debuffs instead of actually hurting damage. Um, magical sharing could be good. Double sevens across the board, and also double ones, because this dude is physically immune. How did I not see that before? Okay, I want you to die, buddy. Thank you. Nice. Don't hurt me. 11 damage. It's annoying, but I'll live with it. Nice. Uh, let's go healing. Okay, good stuff. Now, is the boss here? No, it does not seem like it. Okay, that's fine. Now we're down to two hours. <laughs> Need to get to this boss, but I'd like to go trading. I could probably do both. I'm going to be honest. There's maybe a way I can do both. Yeah, I have an idea, chat. I have an idea. I almost clicked a bad button.
We fight this thing. That unlocks me to go shopping. And then I make everyone else go south. And then I think we're fine. I might have to use an item to give me an extra hour, just because I'm being a little bit slow with this, because I thought bottom right was the correct answer. We've been really lucky so far. And my luck has run out. Yeah, that's a good hit. That's a good hit. Nice! Crazy lady's dead, and then I need to deal with the small fairy that likes healing. Which shouldn't be too bad. Come on, come on, trigger. No, she fully healed. She's got to stop doing that. Nice, good kill. These little fairies just don't die. Fruit of Life is a good play here, even though I'm trying to go shopping. I think Fruit of Life is still a good call. Okay, now we need to go south. Oh, but I'm only going to have two people to fight this. Oh, I made a mistake with my choices. I'll be fine. It's only two enemies, right? Oh, don't you dare be immune to fire damage. Don't you dare be immune to fire damage. Okay, status resistance. Good, we could have gotten burned there. We take nine damage, that's fine, I'll live with it. He's not immune to fire damage, thank god! Now we're burning, that's fine, we'll live with it. No, he survived! I thought I got away with not having to damage him. Got them both with the fire damage, though. That's nice. That's nice. Uh, Fruit of Life is still good here. We didn't take hardly any damage. That's good. Oh, how many little mini fights are there on the way? I don't want to do this. I don't want to do these mini fights. Oh, they're... They're doable. I just don't want to do them. Fireball on the big one, because she don't heal. Status resistance we ignore. Fury slam on you because you're annoying. You die next turn. You do 10 damage. 6 damage, that's not bad. That's not bad. You healed, that's fine. You're dead. Nice. I'm religiously using a lot of mana because I don't mind. I think 12 and 15 sounds bad, but we're doing okay. Easy hit. And then Fury Slam for the kill because she does... Yep. Multi-hitting. Multi-hitting's too good. Fruit of Life, heal up a bit. Nice. And that's the end of the round. One hour remaining. One, two, three. One, two, three, four, five... Uh, let's go shopping first. No. Found the boss. I did not expect it to be there. I really did not expect it to be there. And I don't see a treasure room. Oh, if there was an enemy here, I would have been so pissed. I would have been so pissed. Uh, do I have any embeds? I do have bloodlust. Tax heal for 10% of the damage dealt. Ooh, that's nice. I gotta give that to Gurley. Unless there's something in here that's desperate. Every fifth, five normal attacks, you get things. Extra arm on defending. That's not really good. Cleanse is an ability. Gain two turns of stealth active. Cannot be prioritized as a target. The next tackle removed this effect and guarantee a crit. Just like normal stealth mechanics. Eighty percent damage to enemies and apply a burn to them.
That's just a normal ability? Reduce damage taken by 75%. I might buy Hellfire. Because what's Girly got? She's got 170% damage to a single target and apply the burn effect, which is really strong. Yeah, I'm going to buy it. Um, I don't think any of these are good. Like, I mean, Quill is probably the best choice, but I'm going to buy Hellfire. Because if I need to do AoE damage, I have the insane AoE team. So we've got Hellfire on Ladyface for great AoE damage. Healing for 10% of the damage dealt. Um, I think that's Archer's job because she's super weak. And every time I lose her, it hurts a lot. Because she just does some easy good damage. But then I have to remember the burn stacks now are pretty crazy for the other dude, for the, the Lady Mage. I have to remember she does pretty good now. It's an eeny meeny miny mo. Guidus, welcome back, man. Eeny meeny miny mo. Maybe because of Hellfire? And the burn stacks? No, because vulnerable stacks are good for Archer. No, no, I've got to go vulnerable stacks. No, I've got to give it to her. It's an eeny meeny miny mo, but Bloodlust for Archer is better. Because she does all the free extra hits. That makes sense. Does Dot apply the heal? I don't know. I can't risk it. But I think the extra, like, multi-hit that she does with the little blue attacks, I think that will count for the heal. So that's what I can probably risk it on. Uh, revive a single target and heal for 40%. Defense with embedded. Dispel, conceal, attacks when embedded. Reduce damage taken by two and more armor. I think I go Martyr's Blood. Just for that one less damage when you don't have armor. I mean, I like Quill. It's to all enemies every five normal attacks. I don't do normal attacks, I do special attacks, and I don't know if that makes a difference. And penetrating means it ignores armor. Guardian's Wrap, I don't shield enough to make this useful. So it's between the blood for defense or Quill for attack, and I think with my dots, I go with the defense. because I don't have very much armor. And that means I can also buy a defense crystal. Redeem unref undefined. Huh, maybe there is a redeem thing. Yeah, I don't have any redeems, I don't think. <laughs> but nice one, Gaitis, nice one. Uh, let's see, plus two attack when embedded. Ooh, wait. Does she have an extra slot? She does. Oh, that's way too tempting. I go for the plus two attack. Archer girl, don't fail me now. She's all I've got, chat. She's all I've got. Although Mage is doing really well. Does the flint item only burn stacks of fireball or is it a fire spells in general? Uh, I think it's in fire spells in general. Where is it? Here we are. It's the mage's fireball skills. So I think that includes Hellfire. And I think that's a fireball skill. If it's not, then I'm kind of sad. I think it's just fireball skills. Ugh. I'm still going to upgrade it, though. Two extra burn. It, it's still worth upgrading because I need those those dot stacks. Without the dot stacks, we just don't win. Uh, and I think that's it. I think we just jump into the fight. We're as healthy as we could possibly be for now. Uh, the only thing I could do is waste two more defensive fences. But we're not even on the last level of the game. We're only on the third out of the fourth. 
So I think we just go in. But it is prediction time. Oh dear God. Welcome to the Himalayas. Stockholm? <laughs> no, 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 don't worry. It's Levin. What is that? Corpse puppeteer. Oh boy. That's an enemy and a half. That's a big one. Sharador, thanks for the sub, uh, resub at tier one for eight months, man. Much appreciated. Whoop with Cam. Hey, dude, welcome to the stream, man. Welcome to the subathon. Snow can win. Never heard about that. I know, I know. But maybe, just maybe, chat. The archer's gonna carry us. She's insane now. The mage can carry us too if we get enough burn stacks. I'm just hoping it works the way I want it to. I hope that the AOE fireball works. What does this thing do? I can't see. Super regen, burst limiter, and protector. I, I don't know what that status effect does. Nicest, gentlest, warmest person ever. Oh, look at that. I've been impaled. <laughs> been impaled indeed. Thanks for the 300 bits, Sing. Much appreciated for the support. Thank you so much. And for starting the hype train as well. Hype train's back up, chat. It definitely is. Okay, uh, let's see what we do. Let's start off with Rain of Arrows. Yeah, I know this does a bit more damage, but Rain of Arrows is better because it starts clearing the mobs. And I still get stacks of poison regardless. Now, here is where I need to test, test it. Two extra burns. Does Hellfire work? It doesn't. Disappointing, but it's, but it, we're fine. Disappointing. Okay, let's still go for it though. Okay, fight me lady. Hit the big dude. Indomitable, stop using my abilities. Why are you using my abilities against me? Okay, she hits the big dude, that's fine. Tanky dude takes a hit. Uh, I think we go charge shot here. Because there's no minions. Keep that poison going strong. She gets two turns, so that's two stacks of poison every time. But here's where we win. Fireball's gonna give her like three stacks, isn't it? Yeah, she's up to four stacks of burn. Huge! Also, let's guard for 12. Hit me! Okay, AoE is not great. Kind of works against me, but we are slightly healing. Oh my goodness, she's below half health already. What did she do? What did she do? She did Death Whale, absorbs dead souls, summons a minion under certain circumstances. Okay, if you say so. Deadly Precision? No, I want to go with Charge Shot Normal. Oh, she has a new phase further down. I now want to go Flame Burst. Look at this, chat. Look at this! Mage! 54 damage! Plus so many stacks of burn. 2 plus 2 is 4. That's beautiful. Insane damage. Uh, we're also going to guard here to try and provoke her into attacking us. Look at all those stacks. No! Mage is getting attacked. Okay, she broke to the next level because she keeps taking tons of stats. Quick math, quick math, she's getting wrecked. It's over. It is just so over. Wait, she's in more. What? She's taking one damage. Whoa, 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 I didn't see the minion. Uh oh. Uh oh. Do I go magical sharing here? Is that good? Please don't hit my mage. Please don't you dare hit my mage. Death Whale, what are you doing? Okay, we're fine. Okay, she healed from the minion dying. That's fine. Uh, we go Flame Burst, big hit again. Big hit! 59. She doesn't have any flame stacks on her because she's immune to debuffs, which is really annoying. 
but she dies very soon on 15 health. Ooh, that was a big hit. Come on, come on, one final turn. Come on, lady, don't you dare kill me. She's on three health. She's on three health. Wait, I got the achievement to defeat the fallen sage and she's not dead yet. <laughs> I got the achievement, but she's not dead. So the achievement triggers even if her de her nine lives triggers. So thank you for the achievement, even though I didn't win. The mage was the real boss. Yeah, my mage was the real boss. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. What a fight. What do I want from this? Heals for the amount of MP she gains? Yes, please. Yes, the mage needs this. Let's go. Have a must watch in the cat channel, says Moha. Oh, is it an adorable kitty cat? The more kitty cats, the better. Ooh, we're on the final floor. It's going to be scary. It's going to be very scary. Okay, let's have a look at the kitty cat stuff. Oh, Oh, is he going to walk into the shoes? Oh, he's being sneaky. He's being very sneaky. You can't see him. He's got the wiggle. He's going after the toy, right? <laughs> the jump start on the rug. Yes. Yes, yes. Cats and understanding how rugs work. They, they, they do need a lot of learning for the rugs, man. I love it. Oh, good stuff. Uh, Gate of Challengers. We have to beat two Gates of Challengers. Okay. That's good or that bad? Defeat them to qualify for the boss battle, and I've got nine hours to do it. Okay, if you say so. There's the merchant. There is a upside down puppet master person. Okay. There's an event. Okay, if anything, this is the floor to use. This is the literal last floor. I'm going to reveal the location of the boss enemy. It's down the bottom left. Thank you, game. I kind of predicted that. What the hell is this? Something I don't want to fight. Altar of Crit. Wow, there's a lot of fights I don't want to fight. Sheesh. Anyways, chat, congratulations on the prediction. We did win. We did take a miniature loss, but she's still alive, thank goodness. Uh, but we did technically win, so that's good. He was very confused. He did look very confused. He looks adorable, but he was very confused. Okay, can I upgrade the mage to heal 250% of the MP? Mm, mm, maybe. We'll consider it. We will consider it. Okay, um, I think we take the right route, because then we go across and down. We don't have to fight too many reds. I think we're at the stage where we're just trying to survive. We are a bit glass cannony at this point. So we go right, we heal up if we need to. Do the fight, fight, heal up. Wait, the fight will heal us. Oh, we have to get healed before we do the fight. Um, and then fight that, go down, go across, do this fight, then go down, shop. Don't need the altar. And then go to the boss fight. I think that's the safest way, but unfortunately that means we have to go to a fight immediately. Do I want the Wishing Well? The Wishing Well gives me five Relic Shards. Extra maximum HP, extra maximum mana for the team. Um, it gives me extra engagement from a certain tile, which I don't care about. No, I don't want to spend money. So I'm going to be going to the right. It's a difficulty two. That means it should be fine. The, fount the fountain gives you like uh, permanent upgrades for the team that you have to spend money on it. Status resistance, I'm fine without having my status resistance right now. Split one below 50 HP. Oh, that's annoying. Luckily, I have AoE, though. Luckily, I do. Don't hit my... AoE fudge. 
What are you doing? He's healing? Whoa! 20 damage! What are you doing, man? Holy crap, this guy hits hard. Is he immune to poison? There's the poison stacks. Okay, now he's gonna split, but does he keep the debuffs? Sheesh, I'm not doing well in these fights when it comes to taking hits. I'm not tanky enough. He fully healed. Are you freaking kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? He's gonna split a- is he gonna split again? He better freaking not split again. I can go for 35 damage, 32 damage on one target. 20 on both is technically better, but it does keep them pretty... No, I gotta go for both. It does give them vulnerable, which is really nice. And then I gotta go magical sharing to try and heal her, but also get this sorted. Oh, I hate that they go first. Okay, they hit girly, that's good. No! I'm losing to level two enemies. Come on, game. Come on, these guys hit so freaking hard. Oh, that hurts. When a character dies, you can use a revive. The number of revives is limited. Please use them carefully. Thanks, game. Thanks, game. I, I, this is the first time I'm having to use it. So, if it's on floor four, biome four, I, I can't really complain. That's the first time I'm using a revive. Oh, I lose my movement on the character, though. That's kind of annoying. But hey, I get to heal the campfire. That's that's the easy part. But yeah, soul coins, there's nothing new here that I care about. And one use of revive, five relic fragments. This is what the, the fountain does, uh, Scotty. Increases your campfire effectiveness. Uh, all your characters gain extra maximum stuff. You can use them a few different times. It's not, not worth it for me at the moment. But I will go here and get this. Uh, get a free crit for the samurai just because because I got nothing else to do and then I'm gonna go here to rest together and that brings everyone over here and fully heals us I do like the bring together tactics it's very nice uh, separate into girly over here and the first challenge is going to be up what is that? Double action. Magic and physical immune. What do you what do you mean? What do you mean magically and physically immune? Do I have to win with debuffs? I do one damage to him. Okay, debuffs will work. Thanks, buddy, for being magically and physically immune. I'm totally very happy about this current situation. Okay, I take an 8 damage. Luckily, I shielded that. Are, are you going to lose your immunities, buddy? Yes, he's slowly losing his immunities. Okay, he was war cry, did a lot of damage. I don't like that. Do I go for an extra crit? No, I gotta go for extra fire damage. There we go, his status resistance is struggling. Flame burst. He's up to three burn stacks, very good. We guard up again, come on! Oh! I do not take hits, don't hurt me. She's dead. The two turns in a row, chat. 
I'm glad that I heal a little bit with Ranger, dude. Ranger girl's keeping us alive, chat. He's still immune. He's still freaking immune. Oh, that hurts. And I'm burning with three stacks of burn. This isn't even the final boss. This is not even the final boss. Oh no, he's gonna go first. He's gonna Our go land first! Is remote and unneighbored. Every lost resource must be recovered. No, 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 no. No, why is he freaking immune? There's no freaking way. There's no freaking way. Oh, by the skin of my teeth. By the skin of my freaking teeth, chat. Holy crap. I think I need Ring of Death. <laughs> I think I need it. Undead to one of my teammates. How many more revive members do I have? Only two. Well, I'm out of revives. You got a beautiful crepe, says Tiga. That's great. Crepes are yummy. Did you put it in the uh, food chat? No, you didn't. Definitely. Okay, so we are in a bit of struggle street, which is a problem chat. I will admit that's not good. I just used a healing campfire to get out of that situation. Okay, you know what I'm going to do chat? <laughs> I'm not going to this red fight. I'm going to go all the way around, go to the shop, and then go to that fight. Maybe go to the campfire and then come all the way down. I'm not going through this fight. I'm not risking unnecessary fights. Screw that. I'm on Struggle Street. Thank you very much. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. I have plenty of extra hours. I'm okay. Uh, I have upgraded demonic staff if I need to. I should probably go to the shop first before I do that. Sheesh, I don't want to fight anything red. Red is just going to do damage to me. Uh, and then I guess skip turn, skip turn. Oh, there better not be a normal enemy blocking my path, or I'm going to be really annoying. Really upset about it. Come on, girly. You can get down here. Yes, get to the shop. Come on, merchant. Come on. Heal us. Do something. Meditate heals you for 15 HP. Ooh, I might keep that. The Grim Reaper Scythe? All your characters gain 3 to 15 max HP. That's nice. Holy scale. When restoring HP deals 50% penetrating damage with restored to random enemy. Nope. Increase 2 defense for every debuff. Nope. Nope. I think Grim Reaper Scythe. I need all the maximum health I can get, shot. Class Relic. I don't have enough for a Class Relic. Skill Gem. There's a revive. Arcane Explosion. Mm, no, 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 that's not good. Hellfire already bought one. Mighty swing, but you stun yourself for a single turn. Warrior's Mark, two attack, one defense, one speed. That's insane. 
But the extra health, I think, is very important. How's the stream going? You know it. You know it. It's going horrible. <laughs> I'm buying the scythe. I have to do it. It's so important. Uh, the embeds. Do I embed a meditate in? Gurley's full. Uh, tank is... Tank has defend, and that's kind of his thing. So mage might need the heal. Yeah, let's go do that. Mage gets the heal just in case. Uh, there's nothing else I can buy that would help me. Except an extra plus five crit. That's not going to help me. Actually, you know what? It's near the end of the game. I'm going to buy it. It might help. I can only add it to... <gasps> I can add it to Mage! You know what? She's a DPS person. Let's give her crit. She doesn't need it, but it's, it's, it's something. It's something. Oh, pray for sweet release, chat. Can I take on a mini boss when I'm at half health? No. I should go to the heal, then do the fight. I have to play it safe. I was gonna play it risky, I can't. This is a retro classic? No, this is not a retro classic. Ah, oh, son of a... I can go through this room. Retro Casio. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, skip these two turns. I'm running out of hours, but I think I'm okay. Uh, I need to teleport everyone to this room. No, I don't. I need to go to this room. Okay, rest together. Okay, I'm running out of hours, but we're fine. Trying 24-hour stream for the first date? No, 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 it's not 24-hour stream. No, 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 don't panic, chat. Uh, no, I'm not going to move collectively. I'm going to move with Archer Girl. Mm, this is going to be hard. Come on, we've got a full health team. I have every upgrade I could possibly do except for Demonic Staff, but I'm not going to end this. i got to go in. Oh, i got to do a prediction for this fight. i got to do a prediction because last fight we almost literally died. Did you just literally start the fight by putting my bro at half health? Are you freaking kidding me, dude? Dude! Not cool! And you marked me? Dude! That's that's not cool! That's not cool! At least I have a heal on the mage now. Yikes. Yeah, this is a sword master. He's got tool, double action dual boss. At least he doesn't summon minions. I don't know if that's a good thing, because... Bleh. I'm usually good with minion fights. Mage might die pretty quickly. Half health already. Ooh. Could be bad. Could be bad. I don't like it. A lot of chat thinks I'm gonna die. I don't have a lot of staying power with this team. This team's pretty glass cannony, which is what I worry about the most. Whoa, that barely did any damage. Don't hit me, don't hit me. Okay, he didn't do anything. He buffed himself. No? Okay, maybe I defended. Uh, Fury Slam, Magical Sharing. Magical Sharing does restore and heal her, but also damage him. So let's heal her and do damage at the same time. I might have to keep doing that. Uh, let's go for a... Let's go for a Fireball. Yeah, Fireball's just the best play for us. Six 
16 to everybody. Are you kidding me? Oh no. Well, I'm going Hunter's Mark. I'm gonna lose Mage. Mage needs to heal. Or else she's dead. She has to heal, 100%. Magical sharing here is a good play. Oh, actually, no, no, no. Fury Slam is a good play. Because that gives me armor and makes me a slightly bigger target. I hope. Hit the tank! Yes! I don't like that he took 15. He's down to 15 health. No, I shouldn't be happy about that. I should not be happy about that. I like that he's constantly getting more vulnerable stacks, which is the play that I'm trying to do the most of. But I should not be happy about that. Six stacks of fire. He's getting close to dying, chat. I'm gonna go to guard here. Don't kill me. Wait, he didn't do anything. Why didn't he do anything? Deadly Precision is a good crit. I gotta go Deadly Precision here, right? It does one damage. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. He did Evasion. I need to break that Evasion with Rain of Arrows. No? It didn't break the... Ev oh, I don't like that. Lucky Fireball does most of its damage with Burn. Ooh, okay, that didn't do too bad. That wasn't too bad. Could have been worse. Come on, come on, he's got no more evasion. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him. We can kill him! Yeah! Let's freaking go! <laughs> he was easier to deal with. 500 souls! Oh my goodness, Brenly, perfect timing for the raid. Welcome, raiders. Oh, that was scary. Evasion was annoying to deal with, but... Damn, the other dude was scarier than him. Ever so slightly, because he targeted my tank when he meant to target my tank. Sheesh. But, welcome, welcome, raiders. Damn, that was a hard fight, but the previous fight was a little bit harder. Uh, let's go with Fruit of Life here, I think. We just need to make sure we're fully healed for the next fight. Each crit heals two. No, we gotta go chemical. 1% of your souls, max 20. How many souls do I have? Start of the battle. No, it's only start of the battle. No, I gotta go chemical. Chemical's huge. I've been stacking chemicals a lot. Uh, I've been stacking vulnerables a lot. That's very important. Uh, Wingate, thanks for the 13 gifted subs of the community. Thank you so much for bumping up the lovely stream time. Thank you so much, and lovely for the support. And Raiders, we're on to the final boss. We're on final boss. This is Slay the Spire, but if you had three party members and there were no cards, you just played like a normal dungeon crawler. Oh, I bet you I'm going to have to fight something normal on the way to that boss fight. I'm going to be really annoyed if I have to. I've got no more heals. I just have to live with the health that I have. Luckily, I'm full health at the moment. What's the random event? Trial by fire. Halt. The man stood up and continued. If you can't defeat me, there's no point of you going any further. That's it. No more. There's 100, 412 one gifted subs for you. Thank you, Wingate. I really appreciate it. Also, my headset is dying. Recharge headset is an important thing to listen to when it comes to... Uh, the headset. <laughs> there goes the camera. <laughs> Chat! It's all good. There we go. So, headset needs to be sorted. Uh, wait, did I accidentally alt-tab? Where'd the game go? Hello, game?
Game. Come on, don't tell me I lost it. Load save. No, no. It crashed? I hope that's not the case. Come on, we were doing so good. Uh, let's make sure the headset gets charged, though, or else we're kind of screwed and I can't hear anything. Let's see if I can get that to work. Oh! <laughs> um, where were we? We were up to this stage, I think. Wait, 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 wait. Where did it, where did it save from? Please tell me it's saved from where I think it's saved. Because we can redo that fight if we have to. <gasps> it's saved from the good side of it. Okay, we're safe, chat. We're safe. No need to panic. This game is good. Um, thanks again, Brendley, my man, for the lovely, lovely sh uh, raid. Thank God we didn't lose anything there. And thank God for the lovely believers in chat. Please enjoy the prediction there. Okay, we need to go into this event. Is it going to be the exact same event? It is. Do we fight it, shot? Or do we just take 15 HP? We could take a lot more HP damage if we did the fight. That's what I'm worried about. That is truly what I worry about. But you gain an item if you beat him? Probably. Are you alone with the others? Oh, uh, I don't know. Usually it's a one person event. Yeah, if I'm not with the others. Yeah, no, 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 no. I should probably. Those of you have to listen to actively subscribing to the snowman. Does great content has a great community. Thank you, Wingate. Thank you so much for the shout out. Shout out to you, man, for the lovely support. Thank you for gifting to all those lovely people. And so they can enjoy the content even better. Thank you, man. It's definitely we got a lovely community and I love all of you guys. You guys make this so much more fun than it actually ever should be so yeah and there's the game the addicted called editing stuff exactly to exactly but you guys are having tons of fun and i'm glad that you're enjoying and we got so many more things planned for the subathon so do do pop in and pop out whenever you can and enjoy uh i'm gonna play the safe card chat i really can't risk this i can't risk this ever oh look at that i've impaled. been impaled been impaled again singular thanks for the 300 bits much appreciated um, obtain the title Wimp. Leave from the Twin Blade Challenger in the event Trial by Fire. Now, uh, I got an achievement. Thank you, game, for giving me the achievement of being a Wimp. I'm the Indomitable Snowman, not the Wimpy Snowman. <laughs> but according to the game, it doesn't matter. Okay, I don't have enough time to get to the end boss, that's why I have to use Defensive Fence here. Um, please be no enemies. Fudge! No, 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 not the stupid splitting piece of crap. I have to be together. There's no way I beat that thing without taking damage. You love Olaf? Olaf's hilarious. Absolutely hilarious. I gotta upgrade the demonic staff. There we go, demonic staff upgraded to max. Um, I think I can actually teleport everybody here and save a turn. And then I can fight him. I hate this stupid fight. There we go, 16 damage. Off the freaking bat. And my tank's almost dead. Come on, man. Come on. What are you doing to me? This dude's so freaking annoying. Oh, 
Okay, status resistance I'm fine with. Okay, nine damage I can live with. Deadly precision, do I want that? Um... No, I want to do charge... Um, yeah, actually, maybe I do. Because I want to break him down. Okay, break him down. He's not going to split yet. I can fireball him even further. He's down to 63. He should split at 63. Good. Good. We then go with Rain of Arrows. Okay, we're doing better this time, chat. Ever so slightly. Oh, uh, I want to do Magical Sharing. Welcome to the Himalayas! Good. Do I go Hellfire here? <laughs> no, 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 don't worry. It's Lemon. Oh, okay, taking that one big hit is still really bad to go into the boss fight with. But it's something. We, we survived. I'm Holy Mate. Thanks for the resub at Tier 1 for 11 months, man. Much appreciated for the support. Almost getting close to that subversary, man. Thank you so much. Now take a look at your face many times. I think you look slightly like Pedro Pascal. Uh, a little bit like Pedro. Yeah, but he's got more facial hair. But I kind of do look a little bit like Pedro. Little bit. Uh, souls 31. No, we need fruits of life. We need to heal up that 100%. Mmm, not happy. Not happy about this. Please be no more enemies. Please be no more enemies. This is the last hour. We have to get to the boss or we're dead. It's a chest right before the boss. I think I need that crit. I've got a decent number of crits on the team. Third armor gained is doubled. That is risky. But it procs very often because I get plus two every single turn. But it's going to proc when people get plus two to make it plus four. So that's kind of useless. That's really useless. So I think the Bloodlust Necklace is the only way I can get some extra healing. The Noble Pact only works at the start of battle, not the start of turn. And 10 damage is not much, because I only have like a thousand souls. I've got to go Bloodlust. Oh, chat, chat, this is going to be bad. It's prediction time. It's big prediction time. This is the final boss of the entire game. I don't feel ready. I mean, my DPS is up to it, but my survivability is not. Spin the scam wheel. Exactly, Shinobi. Exactly. Oh. All of this prep. This crazy build. I think this build is insane. Going double poison, double burn. Super good combination. Uh, I still think I chose a really bad... A really bad choice here with Starcatcher Bottle. This thing sucks. Really don't think this is worth it. I probably should upgrade this. Yeah, let's upgrade this before we go in. I got no more points, so I can't upgrade anything else. 35% of your armored teammates, that might keep someone alive ever so slightly. Oh, this is gonna be scary chat. What's the boss look like? What is the buy? What's the final boss? Wow. What? health. Well, I'm glad chat believes. We have a crazy team. The undead went onto the mage. 
I just have to stack. I've got to stack debuffs. If I can't stack debuffs, we can't win this. We have to go big and strong. He's pretty slow. He has double action, but he is slow for his second action. Uh, I think I start with range, Reign of Arrows, because he's got 10 stacks of defensive. I can break that. Yes, it does. It, it breaks it. Five stacks already gone from one Reign of Arrows. Huge. Then we Fireball to get the stack down once more. And then I... Do I have Fury Slam? Yes. Mm, I really want to defend, though. I'm going to defend instead. That gets rid of a couple more stacks. He got plus two strength. Okay, that's not too bad. Is it bad? Six damage across the board. That's not bad. Uh, we go charge shot into deadly precision. No, 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 no. No. Um, we go charge shot normally. And we try and set up a better mage attack. Should have went for Gnosis Guidus? Yeah, maybe. Flame Burst, here we are, this is huge. 62 damage. Stacks up to 7 burns. The burn stacks will win us this game. We're already down to 100 and 170 damage. I need to guard here, 100%. Don't hurt me. I blocked it all! Let's freaking go! Final boss is a pushover. He's a freaking pushover. Why did I get stunned? Did I just get stunned? I don't like that I just got stunned. No, that's kind of bad. I can live with it, but that's bad. Yeah, I lost all my armor. Luckily, I can get it back because I outspeed him. There we go, 12. Eat it, eat it, eat it. He goes first. Don't turn on that shield. No, he's poised to strike. Okay, I'll live with that. Charge shot. He's down to 300 health. He's burning. He's burning. Flame burst. He's up to 11 stacks of burn. Six stacks of vulnerable. He's got great attack power and life steals from his attacks. He's going to life steal from this chat. I need to guard. 22 and 12. Come on. Take the hit. Take the hit. We eat those. We eat those. He... <laughs> The double guard! The burn stacks! I told you, chat, the burn stacks were too good. <laughs> the mini bosses were harder than the boss. Oh my goodness. We're free. We're completely free. Oh, so good. Why do I still have things to choose? That worries me. This worries me a lot. Why am I still choosing things? Please tell me this is the end. Come on, come on game, there can't be more. There's more. I thought he was the end. I thought it was the end! No, Regime, thanks for the five gifted. Thank you so much. I thought that was the last floor. I was wondering why it was offering me more things. I thought the fourth floor was the last floor. Well, that looks like the last floor. Hi, Merchant. Can I... trade with you? It's not over yet, chat. Congratulations on all the believers, though. Big congratulations. Picky was not a problem. Gain two turns of protection. You know what? I might... I might just keep that. That's going to be very helpful. But... What is going to be very helpful is... On both sides... No, I don't think that's a good choice. Uh, 13 or more armor is broken on a teammate. Break the armor of a random enemy. That sounds pretty fun. Once you reach six, we were just going to first of one by this during this battle. Uh, that sounds bad. And I also, that's way too expensive. I could sell something for it, but that's really bad. 
Heal single target for extra healing. No. Restore BP to no. Slow. What does slow do? Force to go last for one turn. That's kind of good. Heal all characters for 120. What about the second four fours? Yeah, exactly. There's the suffering. Max HP, max MP. I like Holy Him. Holy Him's pretty good. Holy Him is kind of nice. The relics don't really intrigue me. I mean, the sledgehammer's kind of nice. But I'm not really getting to 13 armor unless I put two stacks to defend. Which could work, but I don't know what the final boss is going to be. I'm not sure. I think Holy Him is a good call, though. Because what do I have currently? I have... Meditate, which is 15 health. Magic Shield on the tank's a really good call here. We buy Holy Him, and we buy Sledgehammer. Unless there's something else I really need. Extra crit, extra health, no, no, no. See, that's nice. Now nah, we go Sledgehammer. Third armor gain is doubled. I like it, but I don't like it. Oh, but it could save a life. You never know. What version of this is at the moment? I don't know. This is like the newest version of the game. This is our third run. Our most successful run, though. Maybe I go mage armor. Because sledge armor is such hammer. We gotta kill the enemy as quickly as possible. Is armor gonna be the most important thing? I don't know what the final boss has. I'm going Mirage. Screw it. Screw it. Extra little bit of health. Every little health makes a difference. Uh, it's not the right... It's it's a good choice. It's a good choice. Uh, let's go and get rid of Meditate. Yeah, let's go Holy Him for Meditate. Because it is heal all characters for health. Okay. Thanks, Merchant. Dark Crimson Tunnel. Despite your intention to move further in, your body refuses out of instinctual fear. Wait. What does it mean? Press on minus three. Retreat, gain title, and end current challenge. Is this like a Battle Brothers crisis where you can continue the game? I could end the game and just win here. It sounds like end game plus. Do we press on? I think we press on. Don't be a wimp. You know what? I'm not going to be a wimp. It's like an STS final boss. Yeah, maybe. Three reduced hours to remain in this biome layer. You hesitated as if it was your entire body was screaming for you to run away. You still managed to take one small step forward. At this moment, you finally realized the situation is to fear. Gain one stack of silence. Oh, I don't like that. Surroundings feel early silent as you could make out the profuncing thump in your heart. Oh, I get debuffed for my before my first f before the final fight. They're just gonna debuff me the whole time. Lose five HP on samurai. Press on. I got an achievement courage. 
long way to the end of your journey. Oh no. He's huge, isn't he? It's a bleeding heart. It's like, yup, it's like Slay the Spire. It's a crystal heart. Oh dear god. Um, do you have a health bar, buddy? Please tell me you at least have a health bar. 1500! And he hits me all for 13 at the start of the fight. Okay, chat, it is uh, prediction time. Our build is insanely broken. Another mariner, another misfortune. We could just be a misfortune, that is true. What's the buff status he's got? Curse. Oh no, the tanks got undead. Well, if he tanks the whole time and keeps tanking for the rest of the game, at least he can distract the dude. Oh, undead's better on my DPSs. I didn't have a choice of that, that's just random. I don't know what Curse does. I know what Vulnerable does, I like having stacks of Vulnerable on him. Get that prediction in before it's out, chat. This is... This is not gonna be good. Okay, we start tickling him with two damage, that's not good. Oh no, he's collecting curses the more damage I do to him. No! No, it means the more damage I do, the more damage he does back to me, I think, chat. This is not gonna be good. I think I need to heal here. Stay at max health. Okay, we're fine. I don't like the silence, though. I really don't like the silence. We're getting tons of shielding, though, with when I'm silenced. So can I really complain? Eternal life, he heals 25. That's not bad. 25 is not bad. He's blocking a lot of damage. I'm blocking a lot of damage. Okay, I'm slowly healing a little bit. Getting the poison up. There we go. There we go. I need to get this fire going. Four stacks of fire, and I'm slowly getting more vulnerable stacks. That's good. Uh, magical shield reduced damage taken by 75%. Uh, I think the right play is to guard here. Because guarding gives everybody else guarding. And he's doing a lot of AoE stuff. And we got silenced again. Okay, so every two turns he silences me. This time you don't believe Gaidus? Yeah, this this is a rough fight. We got him down 300 health because we're just trying to defend whilst we have all sorts of things happening to us. Another silence round? Can you stop silencing me, buddy? At least the burn's slightly hitting him. He's hitting me through my shielding. I think he's got pierce damage. I don't like it. I don't like that he has pierce damage. We're at 32, 32, 17. I should defend against this. He eternalized for 25, I think, seemingly every turn. Can he seriously stop? He's gonna go into the next phase. I can't damage him. that hurt. The mage is dying. Come on, man. Come on. Stop silencing me. Please tell me you're out of the sun. No! I die in eight turns. You've been silencing me the whole time, dude. I can't do anything. I die in eight turns. Okay, we need to get him down with burning. Burning, 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 burning. I'm just gonna go full damage. Screw this. He's up to eight stacks. We can win this. We can win this chat if he doesn't remove the burn. If he does remove the burn, we're screwed. 
Oh, we got silenced again. Stop it, man. Stop it. Okay, Mage is dying. Mage, you need to win this. He's down to his final phase. Chat, we're winning. Chat, we're winning. I might lose the mage, though. Why did she not get undead? Apply 10 or more power on a friendly character. I got achievement for that? That's because she's too good. I gotta stop the silence. I'm down to five turns left. On the death tracker, but I think we're winning. The burn's gone? No. No! I need to reapply the burn. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't you silence me, don't you freaking silence me. Okay, good hit, good hit. Get that burn back. There we go, we can win with the burn. Do I try anything else? Do I try magical shield? Do I try magical shield? I just got a guard, I think I have to guard. If I, if someone gets through that 24 health, Silence. Fucking silence. And she's dead. That burn better freaking carry me. I'm on four... S no. I'm on three turns. I think I need to attack. I just need to go full damage now. So much silence. I'm silenced again. I gotta go damage. I gotta hit him. Come on, we got, a, we got one turn to win. Come on, he's at 44! Uh, even with the mage dead! Oh, the, the burns, man. The burns carried us so freaking strong. If we didn't have any burns, we would have lost that. And the mage even died. Holy crap, that was so scary. Wait, what is this? What is this little dude? Is that little dude inside of it? I didn't see that. I need more souls. I need more powerful souls. Wait, was it the shopkeeper the whole time? Until I gain immortality. Is it a second phase? Please tell no. There better not be a second phase. Oh, it's flooding. Is that like a heart being flooded and burying and dying? I don't know. It's scary, whatever it is. Complete the dungeon using Samurai, complete the dungeon using Mage, complete the dungeon using Archer. We won. So many points. Look at all the points! Oh, beautiful. So many levels. Yes, the DPS team worked! I don't know how a healing team would work in this. If you're silenced so many times, there's no way a healing team could win. War charm. After using two burst skills, your characters gain one power. That's not good. Five burst skills next trigger two times. I mean, unless you're really getting a lot of BP. Gain one turn of sturdy, which is when the armor faller falls on their own, retains 75 armor. That's kind of okay. Yeah, that's actually really nice. After using three non-damaging skills, the next magic is skill deals 75 extra damage. No, that's not that amazing. Okay, well, we didn't unlock too many crazy things, but we did unlock the final ending. If it isn't our great challenger, allow me to express my sympathy for your suffering. I'll be taking your soul now. Nothing shall be wasted. Wait. Is he asking us to do it again? Oh, it's the end. Okay. Oh, okay. I was worried, shot. I was worried. It could be good if you did a mage healer comp. Yeah, mage healer might work because of the combination of the magic spells. Yeah, from like the non-healing to the damaging spells, maybe. Yeah, but the thing is, I also did a healing spell on the mage. And she did heal up at one point, so it's pretty good. We could have worked something out, but congratulations, chat. Most votes said yes. I don't know how you guys had the faith. But I think you guys had faith in the poison and the fire build. It was the only way. Woo wee. That was rough. That was rough indeed. It's a pretty good game, though. It definitely beats you senseless. 
with the mechanics that it has and the different bosses that you're just not expecting. But it definitely feels like Slay the Spire, but just without the cards. Priest is male, really? Oh, yes, yeah, see, the priest is male. Got it wrong. Uh, Freegalit, thank you very much for the follow. Welcome to the stream, man. Good to see you. Much appreciated for the follow. This game's got some nice art to it as well. I like it. Definitely has some challenging moments. Some of those, those medium bosses, like the first boss is really a skill checker. And what else was it? The pre-bosses to the fourth floor, that was rough. Some of the actual inside normal room fights are annoying. Because some of those enemies are like super fast, so they hit you before you start the fight. It's just free damage to your bros. Yep. Until someone ends its misery. Mm-hmm. Oh well, yeah, they had kickstart backers, yeah. The story would continue. And because you level up your bros, I think that will give them some more unlocks. Kind of like how Slay the Spire does. The more you level up in Slay the Spire, it allows you to unlock new relics. And that's what we were doing. We we're unlocking some new relics and stuff. So I'm definitely on the side of that. Arla says you bought me something. You bought me something. What did you buy me? No, that's Luft. Luft is in general. No, you didn't buy me Luft. <laughs> Alright, good credits. The credits are usually pretty long, though. Uh, Abyss Seminary, I'm assuming, is explaining what the bros do. Oh, you can buff them for the... That's what level ups do as well. You can buff your bros to continue the fighting. Can you change their skills? That is sick. You can change out your skills of your characters. That unlocks so much. That is really cool. I just went with the base character. Base builds. I didn't do nothing to change them. Oh, I unlocked the Berserker. That's right. Heals you for 25% of your max HP. Damn, that's a tanky bro. Consumes HP to do damage. Oh, so he plays within life and death. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So you can upgrade each bro's skills depending on how many upgrade points you have for their level. So level 7 gives you 7 points, level 5 gives you 5 points, level 2 gives you 2 points. Yeah, the, the guys that do didn't realize it. Um, the skill gems is what you do when you complete the game and you can beat bosses. You get these purple gems and that can be used to change out the skills of your bro's when you start the game. Uh, you can also unlock relic for for the class. Oh, to start with, maybe. Because some of these I haven't seen before. I've seen before in the game, but not as a starting character. Flintstone was really strong. This thing was disgust. This is what won us the game. Flintstone, 100%. If we didn't have Flintstone, we wouldn't have won. If we didn't have snakes, we wouldn't have won. Uh, investigation points. So as you level up, you learn and find new things, new relics. Ooh, very cool. Very cool indeed. Did I get the thing that you bought me? I don't have anything on my um, Steam. I don't have a notification of anyone buying me anything. So I do apologize. Just maybe double check, see if the money went through or anything. See if Steam's done anything. Yeah, I don't have anything sent to me. Maybe I just needed to take a minute to refresh. Because I am streaming, I'm not sure. Usually it's pretty quick if somebody does send me something. Maybe go online. Oh yeah, maybe that too. Yeah, new login. Yeah, just, just get logged out, log in. See if that makes a difference. 
How's the fifth character stats and starting skills look like? He looks pretty cool. Um, he seems pretty tanky. He does have a little bit less health than the samurai. He's got a little bit less mana. He's got the same attack, a bit more defense. He's a lot slower. And I don't remember what this skill is. He's got the same magic, but I don't know what this one is. Regardless, um, the dude is based around his HP. Reinstall windows, power on off. Yeah, crit. Oh, that might be crit. Yeah, you're right. That could be crit. So his crit is a lot lower. But this dude's based around HP, so he wants to use HP to do damage, but then he also gains more power and he heals his HP. So he kind of seal, it seems like a upfront bursty type, but he can also heal later on in the fight if he needs to. So he seems fairly balanced, but I, I don't know exactly how balanced he will be. He does have a few cool relics that look interesting. Um, where is it? I saw this one. Beginning of the Berserker turns, deal damage to a random target equal to 100% of your missing HP and heals 50% of the damage dealt. That is sick. It did go through Mage Takes Time. Yeah, it sometimes takes time. That's all it is. But no, no, that is that is pretty sick. So if you're missing health, you'll just deal free damage to enemies. You want to stack health on a Berserker, and then the HP just comes back to you. A new run like Urtuk three times Berserk? Exactly, like Urtuk. Exactly. That's the same idea. You just go with the health build. Where you just do damage to get damage, to take damage, to every damage. Um, every stack of power gives the Berserk extra crit attack and mage attack. That's pretty cool. Because the Berserk is based off of power creep. Berserker gains power for every 2 HP lost. But each stack takes increases the damage taken by 4%. Ooh, that is risky. That's really risky. You would desperately need this. You'd have to pair that with Crimson Orb. Berserker gains three undead at the start of the battle. Increases damage dealt by 2% for every 2 HP lost. Gain armor equal to max HP whenever undead triggers. Yeah, if you don't play Berserk without Crimson Orb, you're going to struggle, I think. Because he is insanely high risk, high reward. Because things that increase the damage he takes is scary. Berserker gets one power per hit, that's pretty nice too. Yeah. 20 max HP, Berserker gets two power each turn. Two power each turn, but increases the damage taken. Yeah, see, that's the thing. They they just super risky, but it seems like a pretty cool character. Definitely seems like a cool character. But uh Yeah, Barlow, I'll let you know if something comes through. Currently don't see anything at the moment. Yeah, no notifications coming in. Oh wait, there it is! I think I have it. There we are, For the King 2. Aw, oh, hype for the For the King. There we go, thank you, man. It just didn't come through as quickly as it was meant to. Keen on For the King 2. Thank you. I think it's up to four characters you can play with now. I think they changed that. Let me double check. I'll have to install and all that kind of fun stuff as well. And maybe we'll have some time later in the, um, the series to do it. We'll definitely get some streams set up for it. Have a nice Saturday? It's a great Saturday today. It is a good Saturday. What is the maximum number co-op? I think it was four. Yeah, four bros and you can move in combat. Yeah. It just looks nice. They've done a good job for it. I wonder how they've changed the combat orientated. Because here you go, chat. It looks like this now. So... You got four people to play instead of three. The terrain looks really nice. Combat got some nice AoE. Oh, positioning in combat. I see what you mean. Look at that. There's squares on each side. And you can push people. Oh, it's definitely evolved. 
That is pretty cool. So there's more strategy involved. I like that. Um, yeah, they've upped the art style. They've upped the, the graphics, which is really nice. Nice. Some people are worried about the crashes and bugs. That is understandable. Non-early access price tag? Yeah, yeah. It is, it is probably still pretty early access at the moment. So hopefully it, they get those updates coming through. They have got patches going through already. One recently last week. But yeah, keen to hear a bit more about it. A little bit like Banners of Ruin? Yeah, it does. Those sorts of games definitely feel like it. Yep. So that's like linger on tiles. Yeah, interesting. It's an interesting thing. You only tried the first with the for the king. Yeah, I've only tried the first as well. Name twenty hours never crashed. That's good. Have you played it co-op and never had it crash? Regime, because that's usually the kicker with these types of games. Does the co-op crash? It doesn't crash for you. Okay, that's great news. Two player. Great news indeed. Okay, chat, um, it is getting close to bedtime, but we still have a little bit of time, a little bit of stream to go. And we're going to finish off tonight with some more Battle Brothers. I've still got some snowman things to fight. So I'm going to have a little bit of a stretch because we've been streaming for 12 hours and I've had very little break. No, no, no. Bedtime does not equal sleep, sleeping stream. No, it doesn't. Thank God. Because <laughs> I don't have the bed to sort it out with. I have a nice single bed, but it doesn't fit in this room with everything else in it, unfortunately. My wife's got too many books. I'll blame that. I'll blame her for it. <laughs> Reset the spins? Yeah, I might have to do something about that. I might see if there's a way I can do that. I don't think there is a way I can do it. I think I just have to keep adding numbers to the spin. <gasps> I know how to reset spins. I just make a new spin. The snowman comes through again. That'll work. Just get a single bed, a snowman pillow, and a set up a sleeping stream. Actually, actually, I have a fun idea that could work. You gotta collect the meme material? Yeah, you gotta collect some more meme material, for sure. I, I have some fun ideas that could work, chat. You might have to give me a second. I, I'm kind of sitting on cords here because my headphones set. Oh, there goes my fan. Fan's already turned off anyways. Um, the headset's unhappy with me because it doesn't last forever. Let's put that over there. Put the headset off for a second. But I do have a surprise. Oh, that might be a part of the sleep stream. You never know. Okay. Meow meow. Thanks, meow meow. Oh. Oh, let me get this sorted. I'll take that off, and then you guys get to see what it all what's it all about. So, instead of seeing me sleep stream, you can say hi to the snowman plush. He's very cute, and he's very fluffy. He's very soft and fluffy. Help me! <laughs> His name is supposedly Galindo. He's called a squash mellow or squish mellow. My wife got it for me. He's a squish mellow. Galindo doesn't just love winter. He loves all seasons. That's a lie. Don't love all seasons. Don't listen to them. Don't listen to them. Whenever, whether apple picking in the fall, planting flowers in the spring or sunbathing in the summer. No, 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 that's wrong. Um, Galindo is an expert at making most of the year. As sad as Galindo is to end them, he throws the best New Year's Eve parties. You hear that, chat? Party at Galindo's next year. For this year. This year, New Year's. Um, Galindo is a Squishmallow. I don't know why he's a Squishmallow, but the Squishmallow is out. And he's adorable. And he's very squishy. He is very squishy, chat. Very squishy. And now it's a snowman Finally, on a snowman. You show he doesn't snowman. fit though. He's I've had fall. it up to here with your hired stunt double. <laughs> and here he thought you hired the stunt double. Hey, hey, here's the real snowman. I'm the stunt double chat. So here we go. The real streamer's in town. And he's watching you, chat. He's watching. 
<laughs> it's like the whole... <laughs> Great, that's the company. There's so many Squishmallows. Oh, okay, so there's different ones in the company. That, that kind of makes sense. But yeah, he's very cute. He's very soft. He's like a pillow, too. Like, you could just totally just fall asleep. It's very soft. Very sleepable. Very sleepy. But yes, Squishmallow could work as definitely my replacement over the nighttime. But I might see if I can get, like, the cat cam set up overnight. I don't know if it's going to work well. But I'll see what I can do. Also, I need to change this over to here and this over to here and this with this there we go and set it up so i still have the cord recharging my headset whilst i'm wearing it there's a giant gingerbread one you saw at the shop oh dear <laughs> lucky i'm not the gingerbread man i'm just the snowman but hey it still does work nearly docks yourself there snow wife yeah <laughs> nah nah there's different shops and stuff that they have it because I don't remember where you can buy those, dear. I think it's probably like Kmart or something. Something like that. Yeah, he's adorable. Okay, let's get back into it, chat. Make sure we have good stretch, good water supply. Apoth, congratulations, man. Good job on PBing your deadlift. 125 total, 25k increase. Damn. Was that at one point, or are you like slowly working your way up there? Because that could hurt if you do it too quickly. But congratulations, man. Big congratulations. I don't think I could do that much. I don't really deadlift, so I don't think I could do hardly anything of that. <laughs> you saw 10 different ones for Christmas today? Nice one, sweetie. Good stuff. Good stuff. Okay, a little bit about this before we finish up today, chat. We have some important, important things to do, and that is getting ready for snowman fighting. We've got to fight all the snowmen. They're taking over the world. So they're working way up. Need to improve my movement at the start. Next size to get a belt. Think I can breach 200. Hey, anything's possible when you put your mind to it. Well, almost anything. But let's hope, let's hope you get there, my man. Uh, Siege Dungeon is all over. Let's go back to Battle Brothers. 